This podcast contains explicit language and is intended for adult audiences. The views and opinions of Gentleman No Class are strictly for comedic purposes and should not be taken literally. <clears throat> for instance, like this disclaimer. Now grab yourself a pint and enjoy. Welcome to another episode of Gentleman Old Class, a podcast that when the going gets weird, the weird turn pro. I am Jake. I'm Raph. Uh, your national treasure, Paul. And I'm Rob. And like it or not, gentle ladies and gentlemen, we are the host of this awesome podcast. Uh, anything? Uh, happen- Why did you stretch? say awesome? Okay, I guess we're not awesome. I like uh, to think okay. we're awesome. Okay, okay. I mean, that's cool. There are some people that think mediocre. That we're <laughs> mediocre. I think um, every week I'm going to hit a, 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 a different word, okay? <laughs> what kind a of A descriptive word. word, okay? So we're awesome this week. Next week we're going to be mediocre. The following, or the following podcast. You can't be. plan your fucking... Dude, la- last week we were awesome, so, yeah. I mean... And yeah. uh, a little bit narcissistic there, but yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, shit! So, <laughs> so in uh, all the, uh, I guess what we were jumping into, uh, what's our first stop, current events? Whoa, whoa, I just ran across well, this headline, Francis McDormand t- <laughs> turns down the original, or the Joker in the original, or origin movie. She turned down the role of the Joker? No, not of I the Joker. I don't know who <laughs> no, that is. Role. I, I don't know who that is. Who of is the Joker again? origin <laughs> movie, starring Joaquin Phoenix. Who's Francis McDormand? Francis she McDormand. was on Fargo. Um, um, the Billboards movie? Uh, oh. Yeah, Three Billboards in Mississippi. She did that oh, yeah. one movie with Brad Pitt. What, wasn't uh, she in... Uh, oh, yeah, Burn uh, After almost, Reading. Burn she after she reading. wasn't in Almost Famous, yeah. was she? Yeah. No, she wasn't no. in Almost Oh, that was famous. the mother? Okay. No. No, 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 no. Burn After Reading was good, where he yeah. opens the door to the <laughs> Shoots him out. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. He fucking gives He's that smile, yeah, like, yeah. <laughs> and that pop in the face. Like, God damn, the way to go. Brad Brad Pitt calls John Malkovich and is like, we have your shit. Yeah. He's like, fucking um, uh, Malkovich gives him shit. He's like, what, in your swim? He's like, you think that's a swim? And then he just pops him in the fucking face. Oh, All man. Right. Good shit. So did they not say like what role she was No, I didn't, I didn't even open the article, to be honest with you, man. I just saw that headline. Oh, good. Like, that's, that's very uh, journalistic of you. what's wrong with America? <laughs> hey, I'm right back there hey, with you, Jacob. Yeah. I get All lazy right. about well, that, too. Well, that was a half-ass current event. Let's... How about a real current event? Yes, Harvey Weinstein. All right, Paul, go with your, go with your Harvey, <laughs> Harvey Weinstein. What about him? What about him? Well, my man Harvey apparently uh, admits offering movie quote unquote jobs for sex says not rapist. So, uh, okay. how do fellas feel about that? He one? admits uh, he admits that he offered roles in movies, correct, in exchange for sex, but says he's not a rapist. Right, it's consensual. Oh, I mean, you could say no. Uh, the <laughs> casting couch <laughs> is real. You know, the offer's oh. on the table, is his mindset. Harvey, the you'll couch. be the death of us, huh, <laughs> Harvey? The couch, yeah. I mean, come on. Harvey <laughs> fucking <laughs> Weinstein. You're done. Uh, Raph, uh-huh. what's, you got anything? Mm. Surprisingly, no. <laughs> I All can't right. think of anything at the moment. I, I, I have a text thread from us earlier in the week. We'll we'll refer to that back in a second. Really? So, we, we, um, did that? I wasn't in that one. No, it's know. it's there. You got the, it was earlier in the week we talked about. It. Anyway, um, one of the things, uh, one of the current events, and it kind of happened while we were recording last podcast, but well, it's okay. Man. It's it's still current. Uh, AMC canceled Comic Book Men. What? I did not know that. Yes, AMC. I after, know, never heard of it. After 96 episodes, <laughs> they, they have canceled 90? comic book. Wow. Well, well, with a title like that. Well, it's because I wrote, I, got I, the wrote them, episodes. I wrote them mouth. and said, hey, <laughs> Ming Chen was supposed to be on our fucking podcast <laughs> at Comic Palooza, and he never showed up. And we had a shitty show because he never showed up. Yeah. You wrote that where? No, <laughs> just kidding. He, he okay. was, Ming Chen is on that I show. I know. I know. So and he oh, never no, showed what, up. He I never don't. showed up to our podcast because oh, wow, we had. Wow. So payback's a bitch, motherfucker. Yeah, payback's Slayer? a bitch. Slayer. You know what's funny? You call me Palooza. Just, just side track. You know, just call me Palooza. I never really man. talked about my Eric Estrada incident. Oh, you never did. Just going back real we, quick. Yeah, we go ahead. Man. We never. Yeah, we never talked about it. You need to get well, it out. I mean, it's yeah, been a while. It's you fucking need to piss me off. off I know that. Yeah, fuck yeah, it did ruin the whole fucking weekend for me. So I was just. I got. I the day before on on Friday. Sat for Saturday. I got a ticket for uh like a meet and greet for Eric Estrada because my dad wanted 
uh, me to sign, get uh, his Chips DVD set signed. So, and it was his birthday too. So I was like, okay, I'm gonna do it. I'll do it for him. And I go, and I re- and I go at the time when they tell me to go, and I realize um, a, there was two separate tents. It was for meet and greet and photo op. And I got photo op. I didn't realize. I thought it was the mm. same thing. And it was my fault. It fucked up, but it pissed me off. I don't, I don't remember on a website when I got the ticket before the uh, if there was a difference. I just I don't recall seeing it. So I go up there and I asked him. I was about to take the pictures. Like, am I not allowed to take anything? He's like, yeah, you can't bring anything. And I was like, I think there's a mistake because I meant to get. Uh, I wanted to get this signed. She's like, yeah, she got the meet and greet. Yeah, I didn't see that. She's like, go back to the front of the booth where the, I guess, where this whole setup is. Like, I guess the, the people up front in this booth, they can take care of it for me. So I go there, and I'm, it wasn't looking good already. I asked, I was like, hey, I made a mistake. I meant to get the meet and greet so I can get this signed instead of doing a photo op. Can I get that exchange or transfer? It's like, no, I can't refund or transfer. I'm sorry. It's like, nothing you can do. I have nothing you can do. And that fucking pissed me off it was like mm. it wasn't about the money it was just the fact i was just trying to get that sign from my dad and i would have just yeah. said something to eric when you walked up there and be yeah, like hey man I, I meant to buy a meet and greet i'd love to get an autograph for right. the thing for my dad and yeah. see what he says if he says oh well bring it over well, here see, I, had, I, mean? I had an opportunity because it was funny and like jacob should have been filming me when i was doing this because like at the end of uh his meet and greet there's like a couple of people i was just staring at him with fucking disgust and just hatred it's like fuck this motherfucker this piece of shit <laughs> i was just fucking furious was, yeah, and, you were mad then, that whole day and right. it wasn't anybody's fault but your own yeah and you were mad at comic palooza you were mad at well, yeah <laughs> erica strata you got damn right <laughs> fuck well, I mean, them yeah, they ruined it, it for me. Suck, but you could have still t- got that picture taken. I, well, yeah, I know, but I was so fucking mad. Like I didn't want to do that. Have I was a like, sign that says "Happy <clears> Birthday <throat> Cliff" or something. Yeah, but fucking, it was or too like, late. Like, but I'm you know, I, it's like you said, there was possibly an opportunity, and Jake even said it when he was walking. He said, "Why don't you just go ask him real quick?" I was so fucking mad. I was like. Fuck him. Nah. <laughs> <laughs> hey, like, you know, oh, maybe well, you should, it punch. was my fault. Maybe yeah, you but should still. do something about those anger management issues, you know, that, <laughs> that blame shift. Goose Why? You know, <laughs> why? Why would I do that? <laughs> that yeah. would take a toll on me personally. Well, that's no. part of my, that's part of me. All right. Any other, I got a couple other headlines. Well, Anybody else? Got I know. I know. Um, so yesterday, Build-A-Bear had this <laughs> oh pay your age pay your age yeah pay your what? age and is that the, shut in it Willowbrook down. well they had an all over I don't know oh, they the um, pay your age yeah. so Megan was like you know what that'd be kind of cool for Landon he's two years old I'm like yeah if you want to go try I know it's gonna be packed but I didn't think it was gonna be that crowded so they I shut that I, shit I get down. to work around Damn. twelve o'clock and it's my coworker's birthday and I told her what do you want for lunch and she's like um uh, just some you know, Japanese food at the mall. So I went to the (laughs) mall and I saw this line. I'm like, you got to be fucking kidding me. It's like worse than Black Friday uh, for a bear. I'm like, I called Megan like, it's not even worth it. You need to like, just don't, (laughs) don't even get it. But they shut it down. Uh, People were there at 8.30 and they were still in line at 4.30. People were in line all freaking were, day to were, save like maybe 20 bucks maybe were, were, were anybody yeah, that's, that's contesting ridiculous. against the shutdown how dare you no nobody <laughs> fucking know. they need their fill their hug bears I kicked a few kids walking past them because they're in my <laughs> way you should they fu- they're in the fucking <laughs> like, you know what you have every There's, right to do that you're a father too you're allowed have you ever been to build a bear workshop yeah, of course that, it's right. the stupidest uh, thing <laughs> it is stupid it, but it, <laughs> there's a there's a there's a there's a, a comedian named Wyatt Sinyak and he talks about his his problem with medieval times, the restaurant. Oh yeah, yeah. It's like I'd love to go to medieval times. Where we're gonna, where we're gonna burn a witch? Like that's <laughs> that's medieval times to me. And he's he's like he's like I have the same problem with build a bear workshop. I really want to build a bear. <laughs> <laughs> you know, it's, he's like I, I want it to have like grizzly's legs and Kodiak's arms, but a panda bear face. <laughs> <laughs> oh, there you go. Okay, I see where you're going with it now. Nice. <laughs> like, hey, yeah. Um, yeah. Yeah. Uh, Rob Shocker, can you give me a beer, please? Beer oh, me. this is a historic occasion, ladies and gentlemen. Oh, who, who, who. <laughs> I did drink two weeks ago, but I was like the past. You did not drink two on the months. podcast. Yeah, the past it's two months. It's been a while since uh, drunk Paul, which I don't think you will get drunk tonight. No, but, you know, fuck no. Well, at least a beer drinking Paul made an appearance be... on this podcast. It's been a while. Yeah, I want to be the lush tonight, the not lush. Raph. <laughs> yeah, Raph is already. I'm already you got about some to catching pass up out. to do. Yeah. I'm already about to pass out, <laughs> man. Well, I, you know, somebody's gonna be laughing at bullshit while you're passed out. Nice. So, uh, my next uh, headline <laughs> that I want to talk about is um, Disney talked about with the poor performance of Solo. 
um, that they were going to shut down all the Star Wars, re, you know, non-franchise, oh. non-saga movies. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Let me finish. Let me finish my. Okay. So, How bad was Solo? What was your rate on that? I liked it, but they spent a lot of money on it. They basically oh, made yeah. two movies yeah. because, I mean, they had to bring Ron Howard in to clean everything up. That's and, right. That's and, right. Yeah. I mean, they had to reshoot all of Paul Bettany's scenes because he wasn't even in the original movie. Like, they had to cast oh. that character again because the original actor was... Anyway, anyway there was a lot yeah. of stuff going on with that. But, reportedly, reportedly, there's an Obi-Wan Kenobi standalone movie that has been permits filed, ready to shoot, starting next year. Mm. Nice. Because That'd it's be filming in Ireland... And this, at the same spot that the Game of Thrones uh, spinoff is yeah. going to be filming at, and there was an announcement that there was there was some kind of clash between the two of them. So like o, the Obi Wan deal already has like something lined up. <clears throat> so that may <laughs> actually be happening after all. And you know I agree. Like Kevin Smith made some really good points about like what you could do with the Star Wars IP and like I mean. You recast Han Solo, which was a bad idea in the first place. You right, know what I mean? Right. There's other characters that you don't have to recast. You know what I mean? Like you could do a whole, you could do a whole bunch of, you could do a, a movie on like why is Darth Vader Wait, a badass? Like, are you saying the they should have kept Harrison three. Ford? No, I don't think you should have done a solo movie at oh, all. Okay, you, gotcha. Or you could have done like a solo movie with Harrison Ford as Han Solo, like right after Ben Cano, right after Kylo goes bad and he leaves Leia, like yeah. But in between, like him going bad in the beginning of the Force Awakens, like but what was him and Chewie? What were he yeah. and Chewie doing? Right, you know what I mean. But By ha- keeping the same but he character, yeah, but he Harrison wouldn't do it because he didn't want to do it. Part of it, he doesn't yeah. want to do it anymore. Yeah. That's exactly right. So, and then you get, I mean, there's a bunch of characters you could do. You could do Boba Fett spinoff movies because it doesn't matter who's in in the costume. You can do Darth Vader. Yeah. And the thing about an Obi-Wan movie Mm -hmm. is, is that, you know, Alec Guinness was Obi-Wan for us. Right. You know what I mean? But Ewan McGregor was he, Obi Wan, and he was great. But he was a great transition. He, he was the best part of you the know? prequel trilogies. Yeah, and I really think was. you could do an Obi Wan standalone movie with of his time on Tatooine and what he did for those twenty years that Luke was growing up, like how he interjected himself into like Luke from life. Phantom Menace to Attack of the Clones in between. There? Or, or, no, from no uh, from. Oh, Revenge Luke. of the I'm thinking, Sith. I think Anakin. Yeah, okay, from no. from the end of Revenge of the, the Sith, Sith, where he yeah. goes into exile on Tatooine. Yeah. To the beginning uh, of yeah, A New Hope. Yeah. Totally do that. That's what I was going to ask. I could swear, I don't know if it's a joke, but they said they want to reboot already one of the, 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 the main movies. Eight? Or some shit? Well, they were talking about scrap. Some, there was a petition it, online to scrap The Last Jedi. Okay. And, and re- I maybe that's what it was. I saw that, too. Maybe it's because yeah. I could swear they I said they wanted to reboot that. it, it was not, but the, it was the fans, not Disney itself. Yeah, it was Disney the fans. See, think about The Last Jedi, you know. <laughs> yeah. Us, we're not going to like it. Okay, but I, it's 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 targeting a younger crowd, man. No, no, I disagree. I think it's hard. It, the up. problem with the problem with the Last <laughs> Jedi was the problem with the Last Jedi was is it was it, it was trying to be something that Star Wars is not. Yeah. And, and well, same thing with the Force Awakens. I didn't, I didn't like it that much. The Force Awakens it didn't played do it for me, but the Force Awakens played well enough because it was enough nostalgia throwback, and and felt like a Star Wars movie. You know what I mean? It mm. felt enough like a Star Wars right, movie. Right. To where you're okay with a little bit of new stuff, but then the Last Jedi took like a hard right turn. And you're like, really what did. is this? Yeah, really see, really that's did. the thing with okay, Episode so, Seven well, it was the, too much like the New Hope. The, the but, Force that's, but that's the point. Like the, that's that, that was the whole point of that. They did that on purpose so that fans get that feeling of. Oh, I know this movie. Like this is yeah. my movie. You know what I mean? Well, and, but then that uh, seems like that becomes predictable and stale to me. Like I don't, I didn't like that. You, then you have the rest of the, the movies to right. do yeah. fresh stuff, which is where <laughs> the Last Jedi is going. Right. Went. But to me, they and just wasted they, their fucking money. I think they then. Did. Well, it made a lot of money. So I know, but it did, yeah. just they could have done a better job with that. <laughs> I mean, to you, it's but see, I, you, under, but, I, yeah. I know, but no, I understand. There's a lot of people that really like. I know, but I understand that. But to me, that just seems like it's just stale. Like man, that just. It just it just too much. Well, it's too record, similar. It really wasn't. It was, I liked horrible. it though. Don't get me wrong. I liked I mean, it, like, but I just didn't horrible. like the, 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 the mo- direction. No. As far as movies go, it was a good movie. As far as Star Wars movies mm-hmm. goes, mm-hmm. I don't know. I, no, shut it the was, fuck up. That's wrong. 
<laughs> Sorry, I haven't, I haven't gotten violent in a while. It's been too long. So, I got something though uh, for Jake. Keep talking over him, um. <laughs> yeah, guys. That's not how it works. For Jake, That's how it works. Wait, wait, wait. Uh, yeah, yeah. The Force Awakening, right? Force Awakening. That was yes. yeah. The Force Awakens. That was I'm for you awake. to weed people out your life because of what's his name who ruined it for you. Oh, Facebook. okay. <laughs> well, no, I'll maybe bring this story. Uh, uh, it, was, it was during Christmas, you know. I work. Oh. I work. Yeah. The UPS store, right? And it's yes. crazy busy. My line of work, Christmas is insanely busy for me. Um, I go in, the sun's down. I leave when the sun's down. Um, so you're I, not there very long. <laughs> but you know, of course, Christmas time, Star Wars movie comes out. Woo! Everybody gets corny, including me. Of course, I couldn't watch it because I get home, I'm super tired, and I made a a, a time to watch it two weeks after the release date, because that's when it was slowing down. Um, I get on Facebook. I remember it was like the first or second day of release day. (laughs) I get on Facebook, and someone's like, spoiler alert, if you have not watched this, shame on you too. Um, Han Solo, dead, boom. And I read that. I just wanted to cry, man. Like, cause, <laughs> not because he died, which I, I kind of figured Harrison Ford wasn't going to come back because he, he he didn't want to play on anymore. But yeah, he wanted he wanted still. Lucas to kill him at the end of Empire Strikes Back. Exactly, exactly. Yeah, he, like he was supposed to die like in the Carbonite, and then they changed it, mm-hmm. and he was so pissed that he had to do another movie. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Damn, but yeah. it's like it really, yeah. it really, it really, it really like uh, pissed me off, and um, um, I kind of like. W- Cussed them out, did it, uh, let it marinate yeah, for twenty four hours. Then I deleted them as a friend. Nice. I, I saw so, you know, them as a friend. Yeah, because yeah. he ruined the, he ruined the movie for him. Yeah, wow. and it was funny. Well, I was gonna say when he, told, when he told us about it, he was like, "Man, I've been wanting a reason uh, to delete them out." I've been wanting His a reason. His name was Tank. And this is it. Yeah, yeah. His, His real was name was Edgar something. I forgot. Yeah, yeah it was Edgar, but, but uh, um, yeah, also known as I remember because what something similar happened to me too. What happened to you? But it was on fucking YouTube on a on a on a via nothing to do with fucking Star Wars. Somebody says it in a comments. Han dies at the end. Like you motherfucker. <laughs> well, well, see, we don't have to worry about that if you go but, opening night. You don't have to worry about that's spoilers. True. Well, well you, know what? You, know, you know what? You know what? Don't surprise me. You know, uh, what were you, what were you watching on YouTube? Like, how time. to fold your shirt or something? And then <laughs> someone just yeah, it might as well be. <laughs> someone like Han Solo died. <laughs> Fucking, and it's a real How like a, a, obscure like old, old like early 2005 YouTube video oh, yeah. like no like 10,000 views oh, hardly any any activity classic. on it I'm gonna go and this trolling fucking them like asshole that, man. did that that's the way I'm a troll now god oh. damn it fucking people just fucking dicks hey, hey, I get so, to do that not them that's so bullshit today, today is Friday the 13th we're recording this we'd like to give a uh, special uh, birthday shout out Oh, yeah. To Sir Patrick Stewart, who turned 78 oh, today. Oh, nice. Oh, nice. Oh, nice. Captain Picard. Rules! Uh, uh, Professor Speaking of which, have any of y'all seen... What do they Deadpool call you? Too? Wheels? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I said, make way. Make way, sir. Have, y'all, ah! have, y'all, have y'all seen Deadpool 2 yet? No. no. Oh, fuck you guys. Never mind. Uh, I've been waiting for, I'm waiting for fucking uh, Ready Player One from uh, yeah, uh, Caleb. I got it. You want me to put it on a USB drive for you? Oh, oh, oh. tempting. Very tempting. Say the tempting. word, bro. I got it. I watched it last week. Let's condone fucking piracy here. We'll see. Oh, we uh, fully yeah. condone piracy. Oh, yeah, man. Fully condone. I'm about right now. It cannot be. I'm about to pirate right now. It can't be. It can't be. Tra- it can't be, uh, it can't be <laughs> tracked back to me, so it doesn't matter where you get it from. Rob, Megan. you fucked up. You let me in your house. <laughs> <laughs> That's true. <laughs> your re- your reflexes are so slowed right now. I could fucking wa- well, you could run and I could walk and trip you. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> sounds about right. Nice. Oh, man. Awesome. Um, all right. What else is in the news today? Um, oh, you want to talk about uh, Papa John? <laughs> <laughs> better pizza, better ingredients, Be- better fucking. You're fucked. <laughs> <laughs> so. Uh, it- they they announced you know Papa John dropped dropped an in bomb. Uh, I think that the board just the Papa had it John out. yeah the Papa John whatever his name yeah because I think it's I don't and, I don't know how recent not only, it was not only did they ask him to step down from the board they're they're pulling him from all of their marketing oh wow. get, we you gotta say that box. With his face on, it's going to be worth something. Oh, yeah. We got to order right? some tonight <laughs> before it's too late. Before it's too late. <laughs> well, you got to remember Papa John. Papa John. Fuckers. It's just as bad like I told you about Netflix. 
<laughs> by one. I gotta look into that more. Yeah. Five second rule. Netflix uh uh corporate you can't make eye contact mm-hmm. uh, for more than five seconds. That's I don't believe that. I want to look that up. I just I said I want to look it up. So uh there's also a Not new right uh Joss Whedon is getting a new T V series. Is that oh. the guy from, uh, uh, straight straight to uh straight to HBO. Isn't series. that the somebody from Full House related? He did to bu- no, he did Buffy the Vampire Slayer and uh Angel and what he uh didn't he do the first Avengers movie? I don't Who? I don't remember. Joss, Joss Whedon. Whedon. The name sounds uh, Joss Joss, Joss Whedon. Yeah, there you go. Uh I'm gonna have to look that up. I think that he did um it wasn't JJ Abrams. I, I'm pretty sure that it was Joss Whedon did the first Avengers movie. Yeah. I, uh, I don't know. Well we should get a bottle it. of Pepsi Fucking and a fridge. Steve Dicko died. I, yeah, I, p- I posted that on our Facebook page. Oh, did you don't even check that? Yeah, well, that's because you did? suck. Steve Ditko, he, the I don't, the creator of Spider Man and Doctor Strange. I don't, I don't know who that is. I'm sorry. Well, I, don't, you know, I, mean, I don't know sure. why I want to be sorry, but I don't know who that is. Yeah, I will take another that beer, sucks. sir. Whenever you uh, he did, beer. he was the writer of the Avengers. Yeah, and he wrote the screenplay for Justice League. Ah, uh, and. He wrote Avengers: Age of Ultron, and he yeah, that's what it was. Today. Age of Ultron. Uh, no, he but Age he, of Ultron. Ultron. he was he wrote the, he was a writer and did the screenplay for both. Yeah, Age of Ultron. Ultron. Yeah, she so they are describing <laughs> his new series. Um, he's got a new series coming out, and it's it's something like uh, some kind of um, like post Victorian something something something. I forget. Yeah, yeah, that sounds uh, wonderful. So, it's, it's, Rob, it's supposed to be as about, a, like, a science fiction drama about a gang of Victorian women who find themselves with unusual abilities. I'm in. I heard women. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Oh, uh, oh, everybody's about women. staring at me for a oh, beer. Oh, okay. Yes, so, beer, why, why you get a beer? beer I want to talk beer. a story about women. I want to talk about a good story about doing what I'm doing as, as a member, being a productive member in society. A couple of months ago, uh, I, I ran into uh, 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 my my ex girlfriend's younger sister at the Galleria, and um, you know, I'm talking for a little bit. She was carrying a box. She was at work, and um, you know, she was asking me like, "Hey, do you know where the post office is? Like in the Galleria?" I was like, "I didn't realize there was one here." And I was like, "Well, there's a map for the Galleria right here." It's like, well, "Let me help you out. I'll, I'll search for it for you." Uh-huh. And I was like, "Okay, post." I was like, "Oh, I'll be damned. There it is. It's." Back literally all the way where he came from because she told me where she was where she works at in the galleria, right. so you know she was carrying that box. She was kind of struggling a little bit, and I you know I you know I like I said I was helping her out like trying to find directions for the postal uh, uh, the post office so she can drop off that box. Of course. So at one point I was thinking, you know what? I haven't seen her in a while. I'd like to maybe just catch up and just talk and you know walk and talk and you know like let me you know maybe I'll take the box and help her out. We can walk and talk. And, but instead, I uh, just walked away smiling and telling myself that I did good and I'm for equality for women because I let her carry that box on her own. (laughs) And I am a productive member of the society. Yes, yes. Yes. The end. I would not expect any more from you, Paul. I wouldn't expect any more. That's a true story. Yeah. Thank you, Rob. We don't need balancing and fucking <laughs> equations. But all right, Have you seen Robert Patrick named a movie. Have you seen this kid? I think I saw him at the Galleria. The Galleria. <laughs> <laughs> we talk about John versus the Terminator. God damn it. Is that, no, is that, is that a YouTube video? John no, the Terminator. No, that was on Terminator Two. Yeah, John versus the Terminator. Yeah, you don't remember that? You said that last week. Did I? Yeah, you're like no. it's not called John versus the Terminator. <laughs> yeah, 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 that's right. That's right. That's right. great. That was fucking great. That's a great title. <laughs> you're welcome, James Cameron. Uh, there, there's uh, also the last piece of news that I can find um, to to talk about is uh, Zombieland Two sequel is a go oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. with uh, Emma and Woody, Stone and uh, Woody, Woody Harrelson. Woody Harrelson says he never does sequels either, but he's going to make an exception apparently. I'm waiting for King, and he King said two. that years ago too. God damn it! Wait for, for what? Uh, King? No. Uh, no. Yeah, that'd be fucking great. <laughs> King Two. Yeah, yeah, King King two. I, I wish. I thought you said the Kingsman Two. I was like, you know, that's already out. Yeah, right? No. 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 <laughs> no. But, uh, just when he's King in Kingpin, when he's getting interviewed. So what have you been up to all these years? Um, he said you know. You know, uh, just um, uh, drinking, uh, <laughs> drinking. That's all I've been up to. Well, uh, but that's 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 past me. It's beneath me. 
oh, uh, um, no, he's like, well, no, he's like, no, he's like, are you still drinking? He's like, no, no, that's, that's beneath me. It's past me. He's like, uh, uh oh, why are you buying? <laughs> <laughs> That's fucking great, man. <laughs> fucking Fairly Brothers, man. Are far, are so, hold on. Great. So, Woody Harrelson says he never does sequels. He was in all three Hunger Games movies. Good that point. traitor! Good point. No, but he also said this, too, before, uh, uh, like, right well, when Zombieland was... came out, right, right when Zombieland came out, that's when he said it, because people were asking for a sequel for the movie, and he's like, I don't do sequels. I, I'm not going to do it. He hasn't been offered any other work because they've been holding out. Everybody's been like, do a zombie land too. No, 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 no. no. <laughs> and then up. nobody offered him any other roles. He was like, fuck, oh, I guess. That's all he's got, damn. Poor out, of, out of the furnace too. <laughs> he's a zombie. Harlan the Groat. Har- was, Har- the, the, the was, ballad was, of Harlan the Groat. Was Harlan his name Woody when he was on Cheers? What was yes, his name? I think, yeah, no, I think. What, Oh man, I think I'm sorry, Mr. I Pearson. I can't Bob. carry you in my back. Nah, I don't know. That's a good point. Uh, just give me another beer, you brain dead. I'm gonna have man. to look it up. So, I'll kill you, Woody. I'll kill uh, all you. Because so, it was uh, slow down there. Ted Danson so was uh, Sam Malone. Sam Malone. Sam yeah. Malone from 104. <laughs> <laughs> Sam Malone, more, now, 104 I morning show. Oh, wait, that's it's Rob Ryan. Funny. Rod Ryan. I mean. For Rob Ryan, they're all, they're all the fucking same, dude. I'm, hey, yeah, it should be a strip club announcer. Come on, come on, can suck my dick for you know two dollar drinks. You know, yeah, he Lord. was. His name was Woody. Woody, yeah. Woody Boy. Yeah. Oh, really? He yeah. took over the. Uh, I always wanted to do that job. The old guy that passed away in that in, during the first season, I think. Yeah, but oh yeah, going back to me, was that old guy. Fucking, assholes. he was the barback uh, during that time, and he passed away. I think after the. Middle of the second season, actually. Yeah, I always wanted to be a strip club DJ. Yeah, Nicholas Castal, coach. They call him coach. Coach, 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 yeah, yeah. Yeah. I always wanted to do that. Coach Carter. So, uh, another thing I wanted to talk about, and I haven't, I don't know if y'all have watched this. Has anybody watched the trailer for Creed 2? Yeah, you want to go Yes. Yeah. Oh, no. Yes. For for a second, I thought you were talking... About the band, they're coming back together. Scott Stapp. <laughs> oh, really? No. So <laughs> Sylvester Stallone. So Ryan Coogler did the first one. He okay. did. And, you know, he's the guy that did Black Panther. Also, right. right. <clears throat> so uh, he didn't. I, I guess he didn't want to do a second one or whatever. Anyway, so Rocky Balboa himself stepped up and he was like, "Oh, I'll do it." So, so yeah. he gra- so he's got a hold of it now. So now they're doing a Creed two, and. Like you see them talking in the, in the trailer, he's you know they're they're back and forth. And he's like, you know, there's too much history, and like he's talking yeah. to he's talking to Adonis, and he's like, I can't let you do it, you know, there's blah, blah blah. And you're like, where are they going with this, you know? Right. And at the, and at the very end of the trailer, they show the guy he's getting in the ring, and he turns yeah. around on the back of his robe it says Drago. Drago. Yeah. yeah, yeah, I remember that. Hell yeah, yeah, man. Yeah, that's gonna, gonna be, be fun. That's one great, of the best man. trailers I've ever seen. Yeah. yeah. I haven't seen the trailer, but I do remember that they're, they're, they're casting for like a Drago's kid or something like that. Yeah, and I think that they confirmed that Dolph Lundgren is confirmed for this movie. If he dies, he, he dies. He dies. <laughs> <laughs> if he dies, he dies. What was it? I must, I must destroy you. No, I must break, break you. you. I must break you. Yeah. Must break okay. You. Fuck you, Vodka. That's when he. That's when he keeps getting up and he's fighting him, and like finally he's like. It's it's like punching a piece of steel. Like he just yeah. doesn't, you know what I mean? Like because in that first fight with Apollo, and like Apollo comes out there and he's, you know, he he's puts his fist up there and he, and he goes, yeah, he goes, he goes, he goes, he goes, he goes to like, yeah, they go to touch yeah. gloves. You know, he not, he, he yeah. goes to hit the top of his gloves and his fucking hands don't even move, and Apollo's face is like, holy fuck, you know? Yeah. <laughs> what did I get myself into? Yeah, yeah there's been some, so there's been some discussions about you know what's going to happen because right. you know. Rocky didn't throw in the towel to stop the fight, and that's what killed Apollo. There you go. So, is that, and is, is you know, is that going to happen if if Adonis fights Drago's son? If it's again, Drago's son, I'm thinking whatever? this one and this one. You know, Drago's not fucking. Uh, well, <laughs> yeah. Drago's sons is not fucking. You know, I, juicing up and fucking. You know, on the machine. Uh, well, I, that, I, have a, I, I have a theory that he is because he wants to eat. Uh, he wants to end the Creed bloodline because he wants his, the mother for himself, Sylvester or uh, Rocky. <laughs> that's my theory. <laughs> He must die. It's founded in nothing. What? <laughs> Your theory is founded in nothing. And I asked you for opinion. Oh. Oh. Ow. Yeah. Shut that fucking trap. Yeah. This is all I think, I think it's going to be a fair fight. 
all strength. All, all strength? Yeah, none of this juicing. I think and shit they're both like going to juice, to Fucking be honest juicing? with you. In fact, I think <laughs> Sly Stallone's going to juice himself. I think that they should have. His a, heart's going to stop. I think, they should have, I, I think they should have a boxing league where you're a, you're like, you're like de, you demand steroids. Like, yeah. You juice as hard as you can, and then you go beat the fuck out of each other. Like <laughs> That would be fucking badass, actually. You know what I mean? Like a, uh, like a football league like that, too. Take whatever the fuck you like want. Let's go. Blitz. Yeah. A real life blitz. Yeah. That would be fucking that'd, great. That'd be great. Like, no, it'd be great. No, they, should, they, can, they can drink and fucking drunk as shit. Right? They just gonna go gonna fucking off, off the tomorrow. walls, yeah, man. They can drink and fuck on the field. Yeah, <laughs> why not? Do an eight ball of Coke and go out there and fucking. Fucking. Dress out there. Not yet, coach. I'm sorry. I've still got lines here. <laughs> <laughs> fucking. And on today's news, no one from the Texan squad died today. Who? No, I'm just saying, like, if they're going to do all these drugs, yeah, they're bound right. to oh, die during right. the game. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, they're bound we're to die about, after somebody. We're talking about washed games. up players that can't play in the NFL. Fucking has-beens. Yeah, like, has-beens. You know what I mean? Like, you can't. We're talking about guys that couldn't even cut it with Brian Davidson in, in reality. Oh, nice. nice, nice. <laughs> they they got to go just, I mean. Oh, they probably, you pay him. I'm telling you, I would watch that there's over the NFL. Oh, there's a market for that. Hell there's yeah. definitely a market for that. Anyway, I mean. so <laughs> now we're not sure why the whole def- uh, uh, defense team decided to do heroin. They're passed out. <laughs> They're, They're passed, passed out. out on the Their floor. strategy <laughs> failed them. <laughs> Their strategy failed them. <laughs> Good job, boys. That's awesome. The quarterback's on methamphetamine. He's back and forth on the field. <laughs> I touch down here. I touch down there. <laughs> oh, you see that tight end? He's chewing nice. the guy's head off. He must be off a bath salt. <laughs> He's literally eating. His face. <laughs> I, that, that's a sport I'll watch. I can watch. I can watch sports that. Is like you remember, that, fucking you remember watch that, that cartoon back in the day? It was like mutants or fucking monsters playing football and shit, and they would like. That oh, sounds no. familiar. Like mo- Mutant League or Monster League familiar. or something like that. Nah. Uh, you know what I'm talking nah. about. Yeah, right? yeah, yeah. It sounds familiar. I'm yeah. going to Google it. I I'm just, have to. And you're on a fucking own. exactly what. The whole. The I don't. Well, I don't was. remember what the what, what the premise yeah, of it was, but they all. Huh? It was a football team, and they would like their fucking arms would get what? blown off and stuff. Mutant League. That's what it was called. Really? It was called Mutant League. Like these were the yeah. players. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh no! Not Dude, they like they would get they would die and like their arms would get blown off and then, like, and while they were playing they would just like rip like rip an arm off and like, like slap a, each in other. The 90s? So fucking hit uh, me with a pillow earlier. Hey, yo, bitch. children, leave each other. Alone. He hit me with a fu- he was squished him with a pillow earlier. Oh, I did. Oh, yeah, I did. It ran so it aired. Uh, hey man, it you ran from, a pillow. Wow, two years really. It ran from ninety four to ninety six. Wow. Those were the days, man. Those, those were the Fuck. days. <laughs> they won't dare to put that shit on the network mm, anymore, no, man. That no. sucks. There's oh, there's a trailer for it. We're gonna have to post the trailer on it. <laughs> <laughs> <All right. laughs> This is great. Oh, fucking Mutant League. Oh, my child's offended. Oh, my child blew up a school. Nah, never mind. <laughs> Did you say blow up a school? Yeah, well, I mean, they oh, can play offended, what but... they watch and play. Yeah. Uh, the PlayStation. Yeah. I hear you. All right. PlayStation. All right, on to topic of discussion for tonight. Is? Uh, we uh, are kind of falling behind, to be honest, ladies and gentlemen, with our plans to get things rolling. Yeah. So yeah. This, is a, uh, this is a bridge episode, but it will still be 100% content. Oh, yeah. So tonight's episode, we are bridge. going to be talking about everybody was asked to bring an actor or actress, and we'll discuss their body of work. So did everybody, I, I re, we didn't discuss this ahead of time. So I think this is going to be really good that we didn't discuss this ahead right, of time. Right, right, right. It could so, be very bad, too. It uh, could we all also need be very phones. bad. Uh, we yeah. all need to pull out our phones to fact check each other. No, you know no fact mean? checks. We'll do that when we're sober. Okay, uh, yeah. fair enough. <laughs> so, uh, I'm going to take a nap. <laughs> oh, that's <fine. laughs> All right, on. so let's go around the table. Jake, oh, who is your actor me. or actress well, that you're bringing in? Um... I'm, there's a lot of them, but I'm a big fan of Christian Bale. Just one. All right, one. That's yeah, what we're going to discuss. Bale. All right, Christian Bale, Raph. That's a good one, dude. It's a little too good. You haven't even thought <laughs> I want that one. No, <laughs> like, a little too good. <laughs> 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 I, I can't even think of one. I'm going to go ahead and go. Oh, um, shite. I don't know. Shia LaBeouf? Um, All right. No, Paul. I said shite. <laughs> Fuck. I'm going to go Jake Gyllenhaal. I okay. can't be confident on this. I've bounced around too many times. I was going to say my man Giamatti, Paul. Paul, that's a good All one. Right, go Paul Giamatti. I'm going with Paul Bettany. 
Paul Bettany. Oh, okay. Then what? Marty. Nice. And if you, I thought about this. <laughs> yeah, nice. yeah. You know Y'all what? Didn't. I, I, I'm gonna take it back. Uh, no, you can't back. take it back. No, nope, you're no, done. No, no, you're right. with Jake nice. Hall. Okay, fair enough. You're with the weird what? twin. I yeah. should have chose. You are really weird. You know, uh, you know his. Oh, okay, go ahead. I'm sorry. Uh, Peter Sasgard. Oh, poor baby. <laughs> with no. Not anymore. I fucked up. You uh, fucked up. Uh, I would no, go with just, Bill Skarsgård over over Peter Skarsgård. Oh God. <laughs> all right, so going. let's. All right. Let's, so what are we, how are we doing this? All right. I don't know. Let's uh, let's start with Christian Bale. Like, what what was Christian Bale's first movie? I don't know if it's first movie, man. Um, I just I'm just a fan of his work. That's it. You know. You so know let's talk movie? about his work. Well, I mean, Empire of the Sun was one of his early ones. I don't know. I don't think that oh, was yeah. the first. You one. remember the to one me, where uh, he was Shaft. in the newspaper? Shaft. Shaft. The newspaper. Yeah, that's when he was. That's the first time I've seen Christian Samuel Bale L. Jackson. Shot. Shaft was. Yeah, was Samuel L. Jackson. Christian Bale yeah. was the antagonist. Was he? In Shaft. Yeah, that was the first time I've seen Christian Bale. The thing that the the thing that you remember that that gets me about Christian really? Bale is his the, dedication to yeah. a role. Yeah, you know, like when he did. Uh, I mean, he bulked up a lot for Batman, but mm-hmm. he bulked up a lot for American Psycho, and then yeah. he slimmed down for the, the mechanic. mechanic. Yeah. And, oh I mean, yeah. And he was like, like the machinist. Yeah, the, machinist. Yeah, the machinist. Yeah, the machinist. The machinist. The machinist. That's, that's it was like fucking borderline death. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> fucking. <laughs> very sick, His, uh, Yeah. It, it's. And that can't and be. And then he fucking. What's it called? Uh, he did it again for uh, the fighter. Or fighter. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Well, when he, he was his brother's coach. He was like a heroin addict or something like that. Yeah. Yeah. Like crackhead. He was a crackhead or something like that. Meth head. Supposedly for the machinist, his diet was like half an apple and coffee a day for so long. Black coffee. And even that movie, did, I think he, he dropped down so when he was a, a, a oh, prisoner of war yeah, in yeah, Vietnam. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah Steve Zahn. Uh, uh, Steve Zahn's in there. Yeah. Red, red something? Uh, no, Red Dawn. Rescue Dawn. Red Dawn. Rescue, yeah, no, Rescue Dawn. Dawn. Rescue Dawn. That movie's Dawn. fucked yeah, up. He dropped man. 10 pounds there, too, Oh, man. fucking eight. 10 did, pounds, man. yeah, but he dropped 50 no, kilos. Some pounds. For, I don't know how many pounds. Because he was just Kilos, Rob? Kilos? You speak English, goddammit. This is America, goddammit. America! Take your fucking metric system bullshit. Yeah, no metric and get the fuck out of here with that shit. You know what they call a quarter, you know what they call a quarter pounder with cheese in Europe? A royale with cheese. <laughs> Check out the big brain He's on bread. <laughs> All right, no tickling or no. nothing. <laughs> no tickling I, I, I was going to go with uh, Christian Bell, man. It's just because he does put a lot of dedication into his acting. Um <clears throat> Like he, he was a great actor in Empire of the Sun. Yeah, like being a kid. Oh yeah. Um, even going as far fetched, I don't think it did well at all. But Harsh Times, this one of those movies I could watch yeah. over and over I've never and seen over. It. It's, it's a, a great movie. movie. Harsh Times. Kind of. He uh, <laughs> he just came out of the Marines and he guess he wants to join the FBI. But no, he no, had, no, no. he wants to join just a regular uh, police force. Nah, he that really? way. He, no, no. That way he can bring his wife from Mexico. Right, but I think he but he didn't he, didn't, he, didn't, he didn't get the job. He didn't get the job for the police force. They wanted to recruit him for uh, what's it called, Homeland Security. There you go. That's what it was. I think ooh, ooh, ooh. I thought it was. I checked out to that movie too many times. <laughs> I, 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 I <laughs> you know, I think the fact that he plays he plays like a like he grew up in the hood yeah. with the Mexicans and he has that accent. And yeah. he speaks Spanish in that movie, and it's it's damn good. I'm like yeah. I was really surprised. Yeah. That was that was post Batman Begins. Yeah, or, or about Harsh the same time. Probably roughly around the same time. I think it was you after. Know, one of my after, well, yeah. I think yeah, they were after, released the same year. Yeah, but yeah. Uh, I think where's he from? He's from Europe somewhere. Uh, fucking is it England or? Yeah, yeah, he's English. Nah, I think he's American. No, 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 no. He has an accent. Who's that? That's fake. Christian oh, Bell. Yeah, he's English. No, oh, he's English. Yeah, English. Yeah, yeah. Christian Bell. North. He's from Wales. Yeah. Wales. Yeah. yeah. Ooh, ooh. But no, he he, like, a, he did that. He did that accent like a thick yeah. accent really yeah. well. Um, he did he, good, he, man. Like Bruce Wayne doesn't. He was a. You yeah. know, my, Batman, I didn't like him being like the voice of Batman. I didn't like that. Yeah, I, but, think, I mean, I thought he was a good Bruce Wayne. He he, he is a great Bruce Wayne. Yeah, yeah. So I, I'll agree with you. And one of my favorite roles of Christian Bale's, and I, I get shit for this all the time when I talk about it. Because the movie didn't get no love. No love for my movie Reign of Fire with Matthew McConaughey. Oh, hell uh, yeah. Yes. Dragons. Dragons, yeah. That was good. Fucking, uh, Matthew McConaughey was great. Jumping the, uh, yeah. uh, the, the axe. The, the, plot, line, the, end. the <laughs> plot line of that movie. Like, I, I feel like that it, it could have been filmed a little better. But the plot line of that movie was super interesting. Yeah. yeah. Like, it was totally plausible. It explained, like... Dragon mythology, quote. I mean, you know, whatever. Yeah. I mean, if anybody remembers, they they're digging a subway tunnel in London, and they find a dragon egg like buried in like a, a tomb almost, mm-hmm. and it it hatches, and like that spawns like these dragons, and the dragons 
eat ash. So that's why they <laughs> burn things. So and then they just take over the world. I mean, there's no killing them. They spawn so fast. Mm-hmm. It just spreads like a virus. And like they're living in this po- post poca post apocalyptic <laughs> land, you know, mm-hmm. hey, and yeah, yeah. like there's a group of survivors and Christian Bale leads leads kind of yeah. one of them of the of the UK <laughs> branch. And then here comes Matthew McConaughey. Tribal tats and fucking yeah. ball headed and <laughs> a long goatee. Yeah. yeah, sitting on riding the gun of a fucking tank right into him and they're like, We're hunting fucking dragons. Yeah. Like that shit was badass. Like yeah. I'm sorry, like but that was awesome. The shot some of the yeah. special effects in that movie were awesome that i mean there were some great cinema, cinematic shots in there i mean it was i, I thought it was a great movie did you so. like how they retold star wars and he said he made it up to the kids you remember Dude, that what? oh yeah yeah, yeah yeah he tells like they're acting it out like he's like he's, he's claiming that he made yeah, up that he made story. It, oh yeah oh, yeah because <laughs> yeah. nobody remembers yeah exactly yeah, yeah. Just, all this shit out you can get away with it claim anything <laughs> i thought that was pretty funny in the movie that was That's, pretty funny yeah I, I almost forgot about the movie. that's a great fucking movie yeah I've oh, never yeah. actually watched yeah. American Psycho all the way through. Oh, oh man, <laughs> uh, it's great. it's a hard watch, it's man. Studio? I've gotten to I've gotten to the part where he kills uh, Jared Leto. <laughs> um, Do you like? Hey, he didn't uh, like his oh, Joker performance fun either. Fact. You, fun fact: Superman <laughs> irresistible. <laughs> fun I like the music in that movie yeah. where he's talking about you Huey like Lewis. Lewis in the news. You like yeah. Huey Lewis in the news? Okay, yeah. so he kills Jared Leto, right? Right. Fun fact. There's uh, another movie called uh, The Outsiders. It's a uh, or Outsider. It's with uh, Jared Leto, and um, that same scene where uh, he gets killed. Uh, that that scene's in the what's it called? That movie, The Outsider. It, but it's Jared Leto doing it to uh, Emil Hirsch. <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah, I swear, yeah. it's yeah. almost the same setup. It's nice. like Emil Hirsch is sitting down drinking fucking. Uh, Drinking at a table and fucking uh, uh, Jared Leto just comes in from behind and fucking stabs him. Oh, nice! Yeah, it's just, it's yeah. almost the same setup. It's fucking hilarious. I was like, damn, fucking simply uh, irresistible playing in the background. I wish simply it was playing in the background or, or, or a Susu Studio. <laughs> <Yeah. gasps> oh yeah, there you go. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh uh, yeah. Susu Studio. What about what's going on? A Christian Bell movie. Um. So yeah, they did that, that, uh, I guess um, out of the furnace. That one yeah. scene, and I, I think it's one of my top ten scenes of all time what? in any Which of one? movies. Is whenever he finds out that his uh, yeah. his mm. ex girlfriend, because he went to jail for so long, yeah. and he came back and um, he, 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 tried, he tried to get back with his ex girlfriend. Well, he thought it was still his girlfriend, I guess, but he tried to get back with her and like, no, I'm pregnant with some other guy's kid and. Just that 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 pain, Forrest Whitaker. Yeah, <laughs> that Forrest Whitaker. Yeah, that's right. I mean, that pain yeah, that you see yeah. in that scene. I, like, I, but he yeah, laughs it all. It, it, it's he so laughs believable. It all. You're gonna be. A, you're gonna yeah, be a yeah. Man, boy, it's so believable. Yeah, man. man. It's, it's sad. It's hard. It's, it's hard like, to watch. Damn. That. Yeah, man. It's tough. Just, that, just check out that, that scene. That, that's the best. That, all right, I'll I'll best I haven't seen it. I have to watch it. No, it's good. But I will say. He All is, of the groat. He's he's my second. He's my second favorite John Connor. John Connor. That's right. He was a badass John Connor. He was, he was a badass John, John Connor. Connor. <laughs> I, I'm assuming yeah. Furlong's your first, right? Uh-huh. Oh, of Kick course. Your okay. Fucking okay. Ass. Okay. Yeah. 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 Hold you the fucking shut, you prick. I don't know who the <laughs> fuck. Da, 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 I don't even remember that. Uh, from three? Nick, uh, yeah. talking about? He's an alcoholic, and he went to check himself to rehab. That's like all I know. Claire, with uh, Claire Danes. Yeah. Claire Danes was in three, right? Yeah. In three, yeah. yeah so Rise Cla- of the Machines. Yeah. yeah I, Wait, Claire Danes. You didn't his name is Nick something. Yeah. He, she, Nick Stahl. Nick Stahl. Yeah. Oh, Nick, Nick Stahl, Stahl yeah. yeah. There we go. Yeah, Nick Stahl. Claire no, Dane. but you didn't hear that. What, I was like, what the fuck are you doing? Oh yeah! Well, oh, you What the fuck well, is with Christian you? Christian Bell lost it on the salvation. Fucking ass! <laughs> <laughs> you know, fucking get over here for a minute. Fucking <laughs> accent. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, you don't uh, think for one second. What the fuck are you doing? Again, we don't know what happens <laughs> now in that scene. Uh, you know, yeah. for all we know, that was so hardcore. I know, man. I but I understand. Like you're trying to do a scene, you should have probably handled it properly. But he was just so into the character and getting into the scene what movie was that for that was Salvation. terminator right yeah. Terminator. Yeah, yeah, yeah yeah and he just Gen- terminator genesis lost it. yeah no salvation. salvation 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 genesis yeah. 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 terminator salvation yeah. can you top me off pally and uh Dahl? one of those uh, oh uh what's the name that sexy chick uh, Khaleesi's, uh, uh rob honey Khaleesi's, yeah uh, uh, no 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 emily clark terminator clark no 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 i'm looking at it right now and 
It was uh, Terminator Sal. Yeah, you're right. Terminator Salvation. Terminator who, who, Genesis who, who, was uh, who, who, Clark. one with Amelia who, Clark. Who, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> nice. I'm very excited. I just, uh, the kid from the 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 kid that died from his Jeep that was that played the the Russian kid in the new Star Trek yeah, movies. Uh, uh, Anton Yelchin. Yeah, Anton Yelchin. Yeah, yeah, he played Kyle Reese. Yeah, he played Kyle Reese. Yeah, and, 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 and he did a good Kyle Reese. Young yeah, Kyle Reese. He did it all right. Yeah, man. He did. I mean, for you know, yeah, being an Outlander. Mono. Like salvation. I, I I would like to think that Terminator One, Two, and like hopefully three. this new John, uh, James Cameron film is going to be. Fuck that's going to be my number three. Fuck. It's just like the Fast and the Furious, <laughs> man. Brewster. Fuck one. It goes goes from one to four Catherine and five. Brewster, that's it. <laughs> Catherine <laughs> Brewster. You know, like, one, here's one thing though. I like for three with the fight scenes between the Arnold and the that new Relax. Terminator. Oh yeah, like, the liquid. chick. Yeah, those fight scenes are like. They were like Just bashing die, each other, like yeah. yeah. They were like bashing each other through I the like walls and shit. Now. When I saw that, I was like, in California. Man, they can make yeah. a Dragon Ball Z movie. Yeah. When they fucking, what do they do? When they, smashed, they fucked up the Dragon Ball Z movie. When they smash into oh, yeah. uh, um, like they're in the restroom and they're fucking smashing the when the shit out no, of not that, No, when they when <laughs> they go to uh, John Connor's mom's tomb and he yeah. oh, and they, and they oh, pulls yeah. out the casket full of guns. <laughs> Okay, Straight, hey, man. So I don't know if you know this, don't and probably do everybody does know this. That movie came out in 2003. Yeah. Toyota had Rise their own of, fucking Oh, T3. dude, Toyota had a big heart <laughs> on in that movie. So yeah. they had the Toyota Tundra T3 edition was released that year, and Toyota had their fucking branding dick all over that. The first car that the chick Terminator steals is a Lexus SC430. That was the first year they were released. Okay. The hard top yeah, convertible. Nice. Nice. Like, okay. I did not know that. I mean, oh, yeah, dude, there's <clears throat> Toyotas all over that movie. Yeah. <laughs> The hey, prestige. Fact check because I Toyota. worked for Toyota, so I know. Oh yeah, I know. Is it is it uh, Toyotas and uh, Black Panther? Uh, yeah, Lexus, yeah, yeah. The, those Lexus. those uh, those Highlanders and oh yeah, Toyota was all over that one yeah. too. The Toyotas yeah. and Hi- <laughs> Lexuses, yeah. Um, yeah, yeah. The all Prestige, right. man. Oh. The, the Prestige was a great fucking. Prestige movie. is a great film, dude. Uh, yeah, yeah. That that I've never great. seen it. It's Hugh good... Jackman in that movie. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, yeah. I think it's better great. than the, uh, the Illusionist, if you yeah. ask me. Yeah, yeah, it's oh, good. Yeah, no, no, the Illusionist is great, but uh, the procedure, procedure is pretty damn good. Yeah, right. yeah, yeah. I'm to give I it guess we wrap that off for Christian Bell because uh, I mean, the only reason why I like the Illusionist it has my Giovanni and fucking what's his name, uh, Norton, uh, Norton. Edward Norton, yeah. Just, oh man, was, we should have thrown Edward Norton. Somebody yeah, should have picked Edward Norton. Yeah, Fuck the one. Uptown Twenty <laughs> Fifth um, Hour. All right. Yeah. All, right, let's, all right, next, Raph. Who was your Who, who was, was your yours? pick? I picked. Uh, it was so. Uh, oh yeah, Jake. Uh, no, Jake 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 oh, oh, Jake Jake forget him. My baby. My baby. You picked Jake Gyllenhaal. I thought you changed it. I wanted to change it, but I'm gonna just go with, uh, with Peter Sasgard. But I'm just gonna uh, leave it with uh, Jake. I Jen think Hall. you should leave it with Jake Jen Hall. He's I got agree. a great body of work. Well, I'm the first, great you know body. what's the funny thing though? Is that you said? Uh, it's uh, a Peter Sasgard and uh, Jake Jen Hall, the brother-in-laws. Can I tell you one of my favorite? Yeah, are they? Movies? Yeah, the brother-in-laws because uh, Peter Sasgard's. Uh, Married to Maggie, oh, to Gyllenhaal. Maggie Gyllenhaal, yeah. 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 Anyhow, his, oh. his, uh, his, I think they're the same person. <laughs> <laughs> Puts a wig um, on. Uh, okay, so uh, Jake Gyllenhaal. Okay, first. What's the first movie you saw Jake Gyllenhaal in? Uh, Donnie Darko. Donnie Darko. <laughs> Donnie Darko, man. Oh, funny story. I got high with the. Uh, uh, Jake's brother. Who? Oh, yeah. I got high with Jake's brother. Jake uh, and watch Jake's- Donnie Darko. Yeah, Jake's Jake brother get high and yeah. watch Donnie Jake's Darko. Brother. That movie. Jake's that brother. movie is so confusing. <laughs> like I, like I watched it. it okay, I watched it high Shut so down. many times. <laughs> Confused, and then I watched it sober, and I was like, oh, "Seth okay. Rogen's in that movie." <laughs> yeah, he is. Like, is he really? <laughs> I like your boobs. Yeah, <laughs> Seth Rogen. Yeah, he's, he's, in in he's in there. Uh, the high school he's bully. one of the bullies. I'm he's one of the bullies. I'm fact checking. Yeah, yeah, okay. for sure. I when I first saw fact. it, uh, what's it called? Uh, Jake's brother Eric told me he's like, "Hey man, I got a, uh, a blunt. What's it called? Uh, it's like half or like." Two thirds of a blind. He's like, "You want to smoke it and watch uh, Donnie Darko?" I was like, "I don't know what the fuck that is." <laughs> I'm down to smoke. Let's smoke. We were watch. Uh, we smoked, and then we started watching. Holy I was like, shit. "I was like watching." I was like, "Man, what the right. fuck is going on?" And there's that scene where um, uh, Jake uh, Gyllenhaal's dad is driving, and Jake's like sitting on the passenger seat. They're driving. And the dad just keeps looking at him. He's like, you all right, son? Just keeps staring at him. It's like he's not paying attention to the road. I was so high. I was like, wait. 
Why is he not looking at the road? And then yeah. fucking your brother tells him, like, man, that's a good eye, dude. Like, he's not paying attention <laughs> to the road. And then eventually, of course, that did uh, become a factor in the movie because he almost ran somebody yeah, over. Yeah, yeah, so yeah. <laughs> my, my, my connection to that movie, I always thought... So the weird kid that ends up playing, like, that, that wears that bunny costume yeah, at the uh-huh. end, Frank. Yeah, Frank. Like, he's the same guy from Gone in 60 Seconds. I can where, get where pizza. Like, where they're like, and this is Fred. He can order pizzas like nobody's business. He's like, what the fuck? Yeah. People got eaten. What does the moron do? He boosts the car. Yeah, he he's like, it what? Back. Can't can't steal the car. Yeah. Boosted it myself. The fucking like, loser. With what? The, the he's like, how'd you? Oh, he's like, all right, how'd you get it? He's like, actually, the keys were in it. He's like, well, <laughs> that kind of defeats the purpose. <laughs> 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 then they do a boys in the hood scene where he gets shot up in front of his yard. Ah, right? No, yeah, doesn't, get, doesn't he get killed? No, it, it, yeah. Fast no, and poor no. Toby. Fast and the Furious. You're good. switching movies. We're talking about Gone in sixty seconds. Oh, Gone in sixty talking seconds. About I'm sorry. Sorry. I got no <laughs> Master time, baby. Oh, yeah. Master P. Yeah, 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 yeah. Now I know what we're talking about. Now. <laughs> after after the fucking eighteen wheeler rips the front end of that car, he's drinking that. He, he's having coffee. And he's like, "You want some of this?" Oh yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah that's right. Yeah, <laughs> I'm so gonna smoke you. I'm gonna smoke you. Favorite Joe Hall movie. Favorite Joe Hall movie. Fucking bandana shit. Brokeback Mountain. Uh, no, 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 I'm gonna. Have to... <laughs> hey, hey, man. I I've seen it. Wait, were you, were, you. Were you stuck in the mountain and all you got is one partner on your side? I'm jerking off. I'm, gonna I'm not fucking mine. a guy. <laughs> I'm gonna get I, mine. I, I, I seen the movie. It's it's, it's all right. Movie. Yeah, man. It's, it's, it's not like a show. Full, full, penita- uh, full yeah. penetration. You know, like he he. One more time. Full penetration. Full. Pit. You're missing an R there. Pin. Pin. Uh, Prina? No. Jesus Christ. Oh, this God is great. It. Keep going. <laughs> <laughs> this is great. Don't you know encourage what? him. Straight to banging, all right? <laughs> they're, not, they're not straight to banging, all right? No first day. <laughs> 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 Penetration, buddy. No more first day. Penetration. Penetration. Did you say, did you say at one point, what's his name? He's like, what's going on, huh? What's going on? Like, he's getting a dick inside him. He's like, huh? What's going on? Uh, about, uh, Heath, uh, Ledger? Heath Ledger? Yeah. 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 Huh? What's That's going on? Another great actor, but yeah. whatever. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Okay. Um, Ten things favorite. I hate about you. Stick the topic. Stick the topic. Seriously, favorite Jill Home movie, I'm going to have to say, was it Nocturnal Animals? Nightcrawler. Uh, that's the newest movie that came out, right? Nightcrawler. Nightcrawler. Oh, with the uh, with Nicole. Is it Nicole Kidman? No, no, no. Uh, Amy Adams. Amy Adams. She is in that one. Yes. Yeah, yeah. Yes, yes, yes. The, the only reason why I like uh, that movie so much is because it's like um, a movie within a movie. Because you see Amy Adams going through her, you know, like you know, struggle of uh, being neglected by her husband, blah blah blah, and her ex husband, which is Jake Gyllenhaal, sends her a copy of a new book that he wrote. And um, it also plays out like you know what's it called? They play out the book mm-hmm. like, and it's just a such a fucked up story. It has my man Michael Shannon in there. Oh, oh Michael Fucking, Shannon now. Yeah. yeah, he's in there. Uh, what's that one chick that's married to uh, fucking? Uh, something Cohen, Sorry. nice. Something Cohen. He was on Talladega Nights, <laughs> Talladega Nights, and um, uh, Bruno uh, Borat, Sasha Baron Cohen, oh, Sasha Baron Cohen, his wife, the, uh, uh, not Fisher? Amy Adams, no, Ela Fisher, Ela Fisher, Ela yeah. Fisher, yeah. Yeah. Fisher. Yeah. the one that looks just like it's, Amy Adams. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> not really. Like, it's just a such sexy a, redheads, man. I think they Ela Fisher oh, is one of those. And the 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 antagonist is what's his name. Um. Aaron Tyler something. He's the one that played uh, Quicksilver on the Avengers. Oh, uh, okay. I know exactly. Yeah, he's the he's the bad guy in the movie. It's just You know what the bad guy in Jake Gyllenhaal's career is? The uh, Prince of Persia the- movie. <laughs> 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 you know my favorite Jake Gyllenhaal movie is uh, City Slickers. City Slickers? <laughs> <laughs> as a kid? Oh, he was, oh, he was the Billy Crystal's kid. Oh, <laughs> shit. Like, oh, get a room, you guys, or something, whenever they're kissing. Oh, yeah, my put God. A shirt on. Yeah, I put totally shirt, forgot yeah. about oh, he's that. Ju- he's jerking it while he sees his parents No, 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 no. I got yeah. you beat. <laughs> I got you beat. I got you beat. Before Jake Gyllenhaal started to do serious movies, 
Have you ever seen the movie Bubble Boy? <laughs> yeah. I don't think I've never seen yeah. that one. Yeah. Holy yeah. shit. Yeah. That movie is fucking awesome. <laughs> He's in a bubble like oh, with arms right. and legs. Yes. Like, yes. Yes. He, yeah. the, the arms flap off the side of the bubble while he's running and like he's trying to meet up with the girl and then like at the end of the movie Bubble they're boy, like right? yeah. oh you do you developed immunities when you were like three or four like you didn't need to be in this bubble your whole life <laughs> <laughs> oh god did, did you know that's based on a, a, true on a story, person story. Yeah, yeah. Houston yeah and yeah, there was a Houston. Seinfeld episode based on him what too like a Seinfeld <laughs> <laughs> really oh yeah there was a Seinfeld I think I might have seen it oh, that fucking bubble boy uh, but yeah man uh, so 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 far, you see, my pussy, favorite you take is it? a nocturnal animal, nocturnal animal, and uh, I do want to see Enemy. It's Enemy. basically uh, have you seen Nightcrawler? That's oh, a good oh one. yeah, that's that a great one too. Actually, that is a very good one. Yeah. Fucking a, fucking man, dude. The guy, he's he's been yeah, on man. October he does Sky. Good movie, yeah, October Sky. He does good movies. Great. He does great movies. Hell, fucking love. Uh, what was it? Love, drugs, and something. Love, yeah, yeah, yeah. I know what you're yeah, that was a pretty good one too, man. That was a great one. City Slickers. What are you, Jarhead? <laughs> yeah, oh, he yeah, was in Jarhead. Jarhead ball, yeah. With oh. his brother-in-law Peter Sasgard. And yeah, uh, true, you're and, right. Uh, uh, Joseph Gordon-Levitt. Joseph Gordon-Levitt killed himself in that movie. Remember? You're right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That yeah. was it. This. That's a different movie. No, that's Jarhead. That's Isn't a different it? movie. Joseph Gordon-Levitt's on Jarhead. Yeah, I thought he was wearing there's a, glasses. No, or there's another movie. It's it's about like. I think Chad and Tatum is it? Like he's trying to escape. Like no, he doesn't, it's, it's he doesn't the guy. Wanna, he doesn't want to call it Return to Duty. Yeah, no, what's, stop loss. Oh, stop, stop loss. loss. That's yeah, what yeah, it is. That's, that's, that's the movie. Yeah. It's got uh, what's that guy's name in it? Um, uh, Josh Hartnett. Oh yeah, yeah you're Josh right. Josh Hartnett's right. in that. Timothy Oliphant was the, uh, I think it's superior. Oh, poor baby. Yeah. <laughs> Who's the other guy that looks like Timothy Timothy Oliphant? Um, I know what you're talking about. Um, Josh Dumal. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> yeah. Which, big which, time. Which one Fergie. of them is? Which one of them is married to Fergie? Uh, jo- Josh uh, Dumal. Josh Dumal. It's disgusting. I know. That poor. <laughs> disgusting. <laughs> oh my god. She is not that attractive to me. No, she is not. I'll see people what make is, a big deal. What does Daniel it. Tosh? But, he calls her know. fugly. <laughs> really? <laughs> Daniel Tosh does. Yeah. No shit. Well, damn, that's fucked up. I just don't find her attractive. That's it. Not trying to be a dick. Yeah, well, you don't want to go too far. as calling her fugly. <laughs> we just say, uh, get, I mean, I'm get a lawsuit on us. I heard <laughs> right? the podcast. You called yeah. me fugly. <laughs> how long would, 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 would that be? How long would that be a Fergie? Yeah, I'd be happy. She heard her podcast. Hey, there's no such thing as bad publicity. Yeah. <laughs> That's true. Come on, Fergie. Uh, okay. Do me. Huh, Fergie? You know, you want to do me. I mean, not sexually, just it's disgusting. I just meant like the lawsuit. Do me. Oh, God. All right. Nasty. All right. All right. Moving on. Paul. Giamatti. Paul Giamatti. Yeah. All right. What have I been well, at in? first? Uh, uh, well, the first time I seen him was in uh, Sideways, and that was, of course, nice. that's great. That's the first that's... movie you saw him in? Yeah. Oh. Uh, oh yeah. wow! But I think one of there's so many uh, he's done parts. Barney's uh, version is like one of my favorite. Oh, movies that is there. a great one. Oh, yeah, Private Parts. Yeah, he was that? great in Private yeah, Parts. Yeah, Pig yeah. Bob and WNBC. <laughs> Robin, get the fuck out! <laughs> I love how he does it. The way he yells, like it's just it's so believable. Like yeah. we're not drinking any fucking Marlowe. Like you the way he says it's so amazing. You didn't see him in the Truman scary. Show. Uh, yeah, that's show, right. He's yeah. one of the producers yeah. or whatever. Yeah, yeah. yeah. yeah but uh, you mentioned uh, Barney's version. Yeah, that's a good that movie. That was an indie movie, film. Man. Well, that's Private a... Parts was before. Uh, yeah, I, Parts I, was... I didn't see Private Parts till like a few years ago. Oh, wow. Really? Yeah, there's a lot of movies I didn't see. Like uh, I've, I've been catching up in the years, but uh, but yeah, Barney's version is an indie film he did. That's a really good it's with Dustin a, Hoffman. So there's a movie that I think that we should all watch and review. Uh, and it, and it's a Paul Giamatti movie. Uh, Planet think, of the Apes. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> plays a doctor. All, take some <laughs> have you, have you, some it's, it's, it's called Singles. Have you ever seen it? No. Matt Dillon's in it. No, I haven't. I haven't. Seen oh, that. Fucking, what's it called? Too uh, Man on the Moon. Oh, Man fucking, on the Moon. Oh, oh yeah. Man on the Moon. Partner, man. Tony yeah. Clifton. Tony Clifton. You got to be free. Dude, what have you seen that documentary? Jim Carrey documentary? Yeah, we talked yeah, about that. Man. Like, that guy went off the wall. Jim Carrey, when he was yeah, doing he he has been, it, man. Yeah, yeah, he has not been the same since. Wait, wait, wait. Are you talking about, like, since the movie? Yeah, no. since he played Andy Kaufman? Yeah. He hasn't been the same since. Like, he, he has been... It. it totally really got into his head. Like, he let Andy, like, 
Like, en. It, there's there's a Netflix documentary called Yeah, Andy I've seen I half of it. And I never finished it. It's good, though. It, it like, was, I just forgot. He, I didn't finish it. It's just so messed up that like he was so in character that he was it, like he was it, playing Jerry Tony Lawler. Clark. Jerry, oh, is it Jerry oh, Lawler? Yeah, Jerry, he's, he's in his he's, he's, in, he's in his what's it called? He's in his trailer and fucking uh uh well, Jim Carrey comes up, come out here, you son of a bitch! And Jim Lawler's like, dude, we were in this together. <laughs> you, you're not supposed to yeah. come at me like this. I mean, Milos <laughs> Foreman, Milos Foreman, like a legendary director producer, is yeah. directing that movie, and he's like. Like yeah. acting like Tony Clifton to Milos Foreman, I'm just like Jesus. Christ. <laughs> he was on, he was on yeah. his time, man. Yeah, yeah, yeah right. Uh, yeah, Sa- something about he, uh, he did not break Zamunda. character. Yeah, Bob uh, Zamuda. Yeah. 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 I think it was uh, Johnny Depp. They had dinner together, and Johnny Depp was like, "Dude, what's wrong?" Like he was just staring at. Him. I was like, "Dude, something's not right with you, man." You know what? Call me when you're good, man. <laughs> <laughs> Damn. How many bracelets yeah. was Johnny Depp wearing that night? I know, right? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'm about to yeah. the top yeah. 25, 25 <laughs> yeah. I'm sorry. Yeah. Have you, have you, yeah. I know I've but, seen it, but have you guys seen that or heard that movie called Barney's Version? No, no, with I haven't. Giamatti, no. I guess, uh, that's a really good movie. It's with Dustin Hoffman and Roseman Pike. And, uh, have you seen, right, yeah. have you uh, seen... Barney's Big rich. Fat Liar. No, I know. I know what you're talking about. I know talking about that shit. <laughs> it's got. Uh, uh, what's I know his Giamatti's name? in there. But yeah, just, Giamatti plays yeah, the, the, the main boss. antagonist. Yeah, and uh, it's got uh, Malcolm in the Middle and um, that chick, the chick that went Some crazy. Chick. Oh, uh, man of binds. Yeah, but yeah. that's a good movie. I would check that out because it just kind of just goes through like he, he has like three marriages and he goes throughout the story, uh, like from his first marriage to his. Oh, he was. It's in, a, it's a good it's a good movie. Barney. He was version. in he was in Paycheck also. Did you ever see that movie? Paycheck. Yeah, I what? think it was. With, I was. I think Ben Affleck. Well, was yeah. Well, you know, I know Affleck, Affleck, shoot him, he him up. He was great. Oh yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Fucking Cops awesome, man. Field. He yeah. chopped the field yeah. on the dead chick. He should have won an Oscar for Rhino and fucking. Hell yeah! <laughs> I know. I talked about this before, and Giamatti himself here gave some shit. Rob, I don't but understand the whole I, um, Giamatti thing. I don't think I look like him at all. Yeah, I think old Rob, old, Rob. old Rob without the beard. Without the beard, yeah, dude, that's like ten years ago. Rob. I know that's true. Yeah, yeah. And Giamatti rocks a beard too. Come on, <laughs> dude, nobody rocks a beard like I. Rock. I never seen Lady in the Water though. Yeah. Oh, I always yeah. want to see that. He's in there too. Dallas Bryce Howard. Uh, um, Dallas Bryce Howard. <sighs> Bryce. Oh, Dallas I like I liked him too. It was, it was minor. What? Did I fuck that up? Yeah, you did. <laughs> it, was, it, it was a minor role, but I loved him in in, in uh, a Cinderella Man. Who I love that names? movie. Oh, oh yeah, Cinderella. Cinderella. I love yeah, that movie. Right, yeah, Ron yeah. Howard. Oh yeah, yeah. yeah he plays a ref, so you can make a uh, fire. Yeah, I, yeah. I love, I love, yeah. <laughs> that was, it was a good minor role he was in. That, that was what, what's his name, right? Uh, uh, who's Russell the bad guy? Crow. Yeah, it was Russell, Russell Crow. But who's the bad guy? Was that? I don't know that guy's name. I don't know. Clive Owen? It wasn't Clive Owen? No, I don't think so. The, no. bo- the boxer? No, I don't know. Yeah, don't, the one that, that fought him? No, I don't think so. It was somebody you else. You know what movie? You know it kind of looks uh, like him. Okay. It's not him. I thought you know, it was. You know what movie he was also in? Was San Andreas. <laughs> Oh my with god! The I don't remember. And they're yeah. making a sequel to that, by the way. Oh, oh Paul's doll in there with the man. Is it fucking the rock in that skyscraper movie where yeah, he got oh, the fucking yeah. yeah. Simpsons <laughs> make fun of it? Like I'm gonna make it because it shows them like I'm gonna make it. <laughs> have you seen Have you seen the Reddit posts about that skyscraper poster? <laughs> no. Where it's, this, okay, so you know the poster I'm talking about, right? Where yeah. it shows him like jumping from yeah. like that beam. To yeah. the skyscraper, <laughs> like all these physicists on Reddit are like, "Here's the angle of his jump versus how much momentum he could possibly have," and they're like, "He's not making it. There's <laughs> no <laughs> way possible he makes that jump. Like he falls way short." <laughs> <laughs> what? Oh! <laughs> Man, the rock- like in Springfield Gorge. Uh, yeah, that's what I'm saying. <laughs> so, on a shit posting, somebody did that. Did they they took really? the poster, they put it over, <laughs> and a fucking skateboard, like <laughs> it's fucking. Great. Uh, at this it's moment, man, great. the rock the rock is just a paycheck, man. He'll, oh yeah, yeah. He'll, he'll pick a movie. He'll fucking. I yeah. watched Jumanji: Re- Welcome to the Jungle on the plane uh, back from Philadelphia. Uh-huh. That's what and, it takes, and it was That's what it takes. <laughs> it was. Not bad. I enjoyed the movie. I did enjoy the movie. Because, I still it, okay, I yeah, the no. premise of the movie, if everybody knows the premise, of the, I'm just going to. It's real about start. the Atari, right? Well, it's Jumanji. So, like, they, the, like, the kids that are playing get sucked into the game, and, and all the characters 
are their avatars in the game. Uh-huh. So, like, this scrawny little kid is in the avatar of, of The Rock, is, uh-huh. you know what I mean? And so The Rock Shit. has to play, like, as this scrawny kid, not as, like, this big uh, swole guy. Okay. His acting ability, you never lose... Like, normally, like, you would lose, like, okay, the original character. You would lose that. You know what I mean? It, it, you Because ha- the character has to play that character, you know, okay, the, yeah. that has to play the kid. Jack Black does that. He's in that movie, too. But his char- his real-life counterpart was, like, uh, a ditzy, popular crowd high school girl. Oh, nice. And <laughs> He plays it to a fucking T. He's a fucking he's, artist, man. Dude, he was phenomenal. great in that movie. D-train. And The Rock was great in that movie. Yeah. And watching Karen Gillian run around the whole time. Oh, was baby. Be worth it. Um, oh, yeah. be worth and the interactions between The Rock and Kevin Hart, holy shit. Those two are fucking so, hilarious. Okay, so it was entertaining then, I guess you could say. Yeah, huh? it was entertaining. Have you okay. seen? Did you see Kevin Hart post that... Uh, uh, picture of him like next to a Lamborghini or Ferrari on Instagram or whatever and The Rock was like don't worry I'll bring your booster seat over for you <laughs> <laughs> and, he was, and then Kevin Hart's like you just mad because your big rhinoceros ass can't fit in there <laughs> so like I, I think it's cool that them two are buddies and like they yeah what was that movie that they were in together yeah, yeah it was Central right. Intelligence no not it was a Central yeah yeah, yeah Central Intelligence yeah it was alright yeah, I thought it, it was. Uh, there were some funny parts. Anyway, we're sidetracking. Paul Giamatti. We're getting yeah. sideways. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Fuckers yeah. Sideways, drinking yeah. wine out of a fucking cup from. Uh, yeah, uh, I am McDonald's. not drinking Merlot. I can't. I can't yeah, I, I'm not <laughs> drinking any more fucking Merlot. <laughs> fucking yelling at a Thomas State of Church. That was awesome, man. I fucking love it. That guy's pretty good. Fucking, man. I would like to meet that. Yeah, guy. he's just. He's just to me. He's just. He's just very believable in his roles, and like he just puts his. I was just fucking great. Well, yeah. as an actor, I can. I mean, that's that's. That that's saying a lot because I mean you can recognize talent. I mean, other people can <clears throat> recognize talent, but as an actor, you can really recognize like what yeah, it takes to to do that. That believability, man. Like you're just so convincing that we're what love it or hate it or or just feeling for like the uh, mm-hmm. resonating with the character and how they're displaying those emotions. And if they can, if they're a bad guy and I fucking hate them because of who they are, then they're doing it. Then they've done their fucking job. And vice versa, if you fucking like, I love that character or whatever. If they're you know the protagonist, right? They're they're, they're doing their job, and that's uh, yeah. <clears throat> that's that's just pretty much simple as, as that for me when it comes to stuff like that or um, appreciating hard work and effort and like these actors and actresses yeah. do that shit. And that's, and that's just, I mean, being an actor, I'm I've never acted in anything. Uh, it, one one of the things that our our goal uh, moving forward with this. Oh, uh, oh. Gentlemen, no class <clears throat> productions is at some point we're going to uh, expand this shit show mm-hmm, and mm-hmm. take it into uh, short films and, and oh some, yeah some music production and things like that. Um, I have always wanted to play the bad guy. I think that we should write a movie. Play that in real life, dude. Just so I can yeah. be the bad guy. <laughs> yeah, well, yeah. You already I'm, are. I, would, exactly. I, agree. Not, I, like, I would like to do that, too. It, 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 that way I don't have to act, because I'm pretty sure I'm going to be shitty at it. So, <laughs> <laughs> If I can sit behind a big desk and smoke a cigar and look at cigar? you all fucked up, you know I mean? That's kind of cool. That's I think, cool. I, 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 think I, I could that. do that. I that. I or that. if I could beat somebody up in an alley. <laughs> <laughs> it's just something you really want to do. Is like <laughs> you don't know you cameras know, are involved. Fact, I can't as a matter of fact, tonight I can't, I'm going I can't to fake punch. So somebody's really getting their ass kicked. Damn. Kind of like in uh, in that Lazy movie punk. in that movie Brown Bunny with Vincent Gallo, where he makes his. Where never seen. You've heard never heard seen it. it. Never heard. Don't Brown worry. Bunny. It, it's it's a fucking terrible movie. It's it, wait, 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 wait. The beginning of the movie is it the one he gets fellatio? Yeah, bad. where Chloe Sevigny, his girlfriend, he's, like he really gets a fucking real blowjob. In the movie, yeah, I know what you're talking about. I it doesn't surprise me. I never me finished it. it. I, it, I, I never it doesn't finished surprise it. me at all. In the event no statement that the you kids? just said, huh? number one, it doesn't surprise me at all that number one, you knew about the movie strictly That's because true. Chloe Sevigny was giving him a real blow job in the movie. <laughs> and number two, you never finished it because that's probably the highlight of the movie. <laughs> I've never hey, seen. Have it. you ever seen uh, Buffalo '66? Nope. No, that's actually a pretty good damn movie. With uh, yeah. Same guy, only Vincent reason, Gallo and- only reason I know Vincent Gallo because he was in, uh, he was the main, I guess you would call him the antagonist, protagonist, whatever, mm-hmm. in a glass jaw music video. Um, ah, for sure. uh, I didn't know that. 
yeah, uh, yeah, nice name, glass jaw name drop, you know. Yeah, yeah. Uh, <laughs> back yeah. in the day, yeah, uh, anyway, right. I forget what um, I forget what music video it was. Uh, but anyway, like it, it, the whole movie, like it's it's him walking around like the city or whatever, and glass jaw's like playing in an alley, and at the end, like he walks up and like pulls out a gun and just shoots all of them. Like that's the end of the video. <laughs> and so like, uh, and, and I was, I read that trivia and they were like, yeah, Vincent Gallo is famous for making close to Vinya. Give him a job <laughs> in his movie. And I'm like, that, what a thing to be famous for. I know, right? <laughs> that's true. He's not even that great of a director, but go, yeah, go he's ahead. Not. Get your girlfriend to blow you on fucking film. On film. <laughs> like, keep that to yourself. Like, we don't all need to see that. She's, <laughs> he was just, he was just uh, doing that as insurance because uh, he knew he was gonna break, she was going to break up with him sooner or later. <laughs> all right, well, I'm done with mine. Rob, what's your uh, sexy body at work you want to describe? Uh, sexy body. I, I picked, sound sexy. I picked uh, Paul Bettany. Hmm, yeah, oh, that, that's why? Not sound why sexy. would you pick him? Paul Bettany uh, because he played Jeffrey Marvel. Chaucer in A Knight's Tale next to Heath Ledger. Yeah. He Another, was all, he was he, did, he yeah. was in A Beautiful Mind, right? I haven't ever seen. A Beautiful I think so. Mind. Yeah, yeah. I think he, he was, plays yeah. one of the imaginary. Yeah, yeah, yeah he is. Yeah, yeah. He, is. he was also in Kiss Kiss Bang Bang. Is that him in never Da Vinci that. Code? He was. Oh, yes, he uh, was in Da Vinci the, Code. Like the, I don't remember him being in Kiss Kiss Bang Bang. It's not Let's see what it's happens when I do this. Did you just ah. say, oh, my back? <laughs> yeah, no, he did. <laughs> oh. Let's see what happens when I and, do uh, this. And Paul Bettany's married to Jennifer Connelly. <laughs> he is oh. married. Oh. So Paul Bettany is married. So that's one of the best. Hey, man. One of the married, most. Though, yeah. Yeah. One, yeah. One, yeah. one of the most. <laughs> she did a- ass to ass. Do you yeah. remember yeah. career opportunities? Career opportunities. No, ultra, what's it called? Career uh, opportunities, no? Yeah, but uh-uh. uh, they, 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 they use that movie for a music video somebody made for uh, uh, Sunsets by, um, what's it called? What uh, that the Midnight. The one with their stepping, that movie. Uh, the career opportunities? Yeah, remember I told you, we were watching it. Yeah, no, no, no. Target. Career opportunities. Yeah, well, is, they're stuck in Target. She's, yeah, she's yeah, riding yeah, this yeah. little pony, yeah, you're man. Right, you're right, yeah, you're right. yeah, yeah. <sighs> the music videos. Check it out, like, because you like that song, Ass. Sunsets, but it's... Yeah, 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 Sunset, yeah, Sunset from Friday the Midnight. Said, yeah, yeah, oh, yeah. They use that movie well, for a uh, music uh, video. Well, Damn somebody it, what's did. The movie? What's the movie? Don't say it. Don't say it. Don't say it. Don't say it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Fuck that movie. Anyway, so one of the coolest things that I thought that's happened as of late... Paul Bettany, most recently famous for his role as Jarvis, Jarvis. the original Iron Man going forward, right. becoming the Vision. Um, so I'm when, I'm when he was Jarvis, <laughs> he was the voice in Tony Stark's suit. So yeah. when he became the right. Vision, when Tony Stark picked a new voice, uh-huh. he picked Friday. And Jennifer Conley is the voice for of Spider-Man. Oh no, shit! Yeah, yeah. yeah Jennifer Conley is uh, the voice for the Spider-Man suit. No, 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 no. For uh, yeah. Oh, for the Spider-Man suit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Jennifer Conley is right. right. for the right. Spider-Man, yeah, for the Spider-Man suit. suit. <laughs> table to turn, Rob. Damn. I know my shits. Not well, the I'm podcast not. table, but the table has turned. The table, not yeah. The, the, Okay. Uh, <laughs> okay, maybe I, uh, picked, I think I'm ready for a beer now. Uh, Has anybody you, called uh, you? He drank all your PBR. He uh, was supposed to drink those because he owed me fellatio. Now he's gonna have to suck my. That's dick. true. That's true. <laughs> hey, you're not gonna like it either. I'm not. Yeah. Either one of y'all. I, I'm gonna, gonna like it. A, I'm gonna last it's a long time. Time. It's gonna be, it it's gonna be soft the whole time. It's just gonna be weird. Nice. <laughs> ultra, ultra Lucy K. It's not even very hard. It's just soft. Only turned barely hard. Dick. And just crying and only. Together. Now put oh, this no. bubble right. gum. Holy now put this bubble gum in your mouth. <laughs> <laughs> He's got the pop rocks. <laughs> oh, that's uh, so there, there's some really great Paul Bettany movies. Oh. So oh, I, man, I thought you were done dude, talking. Oh yeah, Fuck. beers. Um, yeah, no, there is great. He's Paul still Bettany. I'll take a Miller man. too, please. Sir. Yeah, me too. You hear that, Miller? Hey, if you're listening, I'm fucking you know sponsor yeah. Miller. That'd be great. Notice the absence of Rob is just so much better. It is. Thank you. Is it? I can oh, is it? <laughs> you can go to go Governor of Arizona. Governor. Oh, I gotta go do that soon. The Governor of Arizona. I'm the Governor. The governor. Yeah. That's mad. Is that your? Oh, we need one more. Okay. Uh, we'll, we'll, put, we'll put some elevator music on right now. Um, right. So we'll, we'll discuss. <laughs> <laughs> so Wait, I forgot. Why was I supposed to do uh, chew My... bubble gum? Okay. <laughs> <laughs> I who, saw, who saw a Knight's Tale? I mean, back in the yeah, day. Yeah, back in the day. It was on TBS for like 
fucking 24 hours. Yeah, I mean, like, <laughs> really? it's yeah. it really was, man. It's it's a, <laughs> it is a great fucking movie. Paul is that Bettany, what he, Paul he Bettany plays Jeffrey Chaucer. I'm a big fan of Jeffrey Chaucer. Jeffrey Chaucer. Right. Jeffrey Chaucer. Chaucer yeah. <laughs> and uh, that was the first movie I ever saw him Isn't in. Isn't Robert Baratheon in that movie? The, play, the guy that played Robert Baratheon in Yes, Game of yes. Him and Alan Tudyk were the uh, Heath Ledger squires. There you go, squires. The yes. guy yeah. that plays okay. Robert <laughs> Baratheon. <laughs> <laughs> he also uh, plays uh, Fred Flintstone. Yeah. <laughs> oh, he uh, does. Yeah, and the second one, <laughs> the second I was going with Jack. Vegas. I was going with Jack Frost. He was in the band Billy with Baldwin and Ma- is, Michael Keaton. Uh, uh, Mark uh, Addy is his name. Mark Addy. There you go. Yeah. Mark <laughs> Addy. Uh, uh, he played Friar Boston. Tuck. He played Friar Tuck in that Robin Hood thing with uh, Russell Crowe. Oh, oh, you're right. <laughs> Fucking R- Russell Crowe. Make a movie. Make a movie. Around the world. Around the world. Glorious times. The Venus time. The like Chinaman. Right. <laughs> Where's that Capal fucking baby. cancer? <laughs> We didn't mean to interrupt okay. you like the way we did with Paul. Uh, it's Paul, fine. I re- it's I completely fine. No, I I'm, I'm, not as familiar, tr- I'm not as familiar. I'm not as familiar with Paul Giamatti's work. Yeah. I, I I I do like. He was really good in the yeah. movies that I've seen him in. Right, right, right. He was really right good in. Uh, I really liked him in. Um, uh, as Rhino, not, yes, <laughs> Rhino especially. <laughs> <laughs> Alexei Sekhrov. Um, <laughs> Uh, but in the in, with the Jim Carrey movie, Man of the oh, Moon. Oh, Man of the Moon. Yeah. No, he was phenomenal. Okay. He was phenomenal, yeah. Yeah. phenomenal man. Yeah. Well, hold on, hold on, Rob. Did did you ever see the movie that uh, Paul Bendy directed? Which one? Uh, I think it was called Shelter. I think it was with uh, his wife uh, Jennifer Connelly and uh, uh, what's it called the guy that plays Falcon, Anthony. Uh, uh, Anthony An- Mackie. Yeah, Anthony Mackie. Uh, uh-uh, I haven't seen. They it. play as uh, homeless people on the streets of New York. No, I haven't seen that. I did see Legion. I know a lot of people Legion didn't see was Legion. Good. I uh, like that one. It was oh, kind of yeah. weird. Do you remember what it? Yeah. It's like the baby, like it, it's yeah. like the end of the world or whatever. Ooh. And like he plays an angel and he has to protect this was it, baby. Oh, I thought it was. All these people are they demons called him priest, and shit. right? Yeah. 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 He was an yeah. angel, though. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Um, yeah. That was, I mean, it was a weird movie. I've only seen it once, maybe twice. Um, but it was still good. Um, yeah. Yeah. And no, it I seems agree like with you on that. It, it seems like he's like one of the most A list actors that's getting hired for stuff nowadays. Uh, no, Priest was a different movie. Yeah, it was a different. Yeah, okay, Priest was a mind. different movie. Um, Legion was. It, it it all takes place in this diner in the middle of nowhere. Yeah, okay. Okay. I've seen Quaid. that. Yeah, I mean Dennis Quaid. What's her name for the OC? Definitely not Randy. What's her name for the OC? Yeah, as well. Yeah, yeah. Uh, yeah. don't yeah. be stingy. The, the don't sister, be stingy. I know her. I forgot her name. Love oh, dude. Movie. Hey, but Randy Quaid did do a damn You're good job in that one movie. Die. Vegas Vacation? Fucking old <laughs> bitch. <laughs> <laughs> old vacation. Give me the yellow. Hey, <laughs> no, the yellow? The, the That's old, what we just old, talking about. The old bitch with the steak. You're all gonna fucking die. That baby's gonna burn in hell. <laughs> yeah, that, yeah, dude, that was some one. fucked up that, shit. Yeah, that, that was scary, dude. man. <laughs> yeah. You're all gonna fucking die. Fucking jagged teeth like a yeah. child yeah. annoying. That shit was some fucking... I, you know, I'll, like I'll, I'll, he was also in Master and Commander, which was a great movie. Russell Crowe. Russell Crowe. <laughs> Hell, man. This <laughs> <laughs> came out. <laughs> I used to watch that shit. I remember, <laughs> I, I remember when I was living in San Diego, I would, I would get drunk as shit in my apartment, and I would watch, like, the first time I saw that was on TV as a rerun. For that episode with Russell Crowe like, yeah. on South Park, yeah, and I couldn't stop fucking laughing. I was laughing so hard. It was like eleven at Just night on a weekday. It's crazy. No, but like I can't imagine my neighbors because like hot college <laughs> chicks because near that one fifty one you were chugging. It was man. Near co- uh, college where I lived in San Diego, <laughs> Cardi and 51. I would fucking laugh hysterically. They probably think I was fucking. I should be locked the up. The ship in Master Commander was right there in Coronado over there. Oh yeah, no shit. Yeah. Oh, okay, cool, nice. Cool. 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 Yeah. Yeah. yeah, I live in by SDSU San Diego State. Oh University. yeah, you get some Woo. hot trim oh, over there. Oh my god, and I was stupid and do shit. I was so scared of them. I <laughs> fucked it. Uh, I can't imagine how much I freaked oh, them out. Oh Jesus. Yeah. Made but Marian. you know that's nothing new, right? Yeah, that doesn't surprise anyone. Yeah, that's okay. Yeah. Uh, shit happens. Yeah. There was um, God, I had something I was going to talk about, and I I don't remember what it was now. Like, you know, either way, Leslie it would have been you know uh, <laughs> Leslie, man. Yeah. Ow! 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 There's so many good. 
I, I, I want to. I feel like we. Yeah, you so have to drop more. any Marvel movies. I thought you were going to drop a whole bunch of Marvel movies. What are you talking about? I did. He plays Jarvis, and I guess it. Yeah, I guess you're right. That's right. <laughs> you're right. You did mention. He's that. the same character. How many Marvel characters, characters yeah, can right. Bob uh, Paul Bettany play? <laughs> Two. Yeah, yeah. Jarvis. I know, right? And the Vision. <laughs> it's like, it's like, man. Man. Yeah, I guess you're right. Yeah. More demanding. Jake oh, okay. Says. Well, what's your favorite Paul Bettany movie? My favorite Paul Bettany movie Ooh, is. Uh, you should go around the table on yeah. the, uh, all the yeah, actors. Yeah. My favorite Paul Bettany movie is A Knight's Tale. My favorite. Uh, who was your actor again? Christian Bale. Christian. My favorite Christian Bale movie is Batman Begins. All right. Um, Jake Gyllenhaal right here. What's Donnie your Darko. Okay. And uh, it's a tie Paul Giamatti. Money. It's a tie between Big Fat Liar. Okay. That's my favorite. Uh, uh, yeah, it's a, it's Jacob's it's, it's turn. A, it's a tie between uh, uh, Sideways and Barney's. Hold on, hold on. No, 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 it's no. It's no, your turn. It's not your turn. <laughs> I thought you were asking me. No, no, no. no, no, no. We're, we're going one we're going at a time, around and we're choosing uh, whoever clockwise. Yeah, yeah, your yeah, favorite. Your favorite of of movie. your own and everybody else's. Yeah. So now it's Jacob's turn. So Jake's so he's going to pick his own. It, it, it's it's hard, but I would say a harsh times for Christian Bale, Jill and Hall. Not see slickers. I want to say sleep. <laughs> <laughs> um, but probably, um, I don't know. Nightcrawler was pretty badass. So okay, I go for Nightcrawler. Giamatti, obviously, Man on the Moon, and Bettany. Uh, I'm, not, I'm not. I haven't watched all his a lot of his movies to be honest with you. But I'll probably just say uh, Da Vinci Code because I, I like Da Vinci Code. That was pretty good. Oh yeah, Da Vinci Code was good. Okay. Uh, my go. Uh, Jill and all. Shit, man. Um. Oh, yeah, um, what's it called? Uh, Nocturnal Animal. It's one of my favorites. Uh, Giomani. Uh, I'm probably gonna have to go with Barney. Barney's uh, version. version. Barney's version. Uh, Paul Bettany. Um, damn it, I can't remember the name of it. Something about I think it was called Blood Brothers or some shit like that. It's with uh, him and Stephen Graham. Stephen I can't. Graham. Uh, can't. Jesus fucking Christ, you're taking too fucking long. Wasn't going to get to my fucking turn. Hold on. You went your goddamn there. turn. And then uh, Bale, Christian baby. Bell, um, I'm probably going to have to say... Um, All right, Paul. Okay. <laughs> first thing that comes to mind, first thing that comes to mind, because that's probably going to be one of your favorite First movies. thing to come to mind? Uh, Christian uh, Bell. Like you... Christian Bell? Shit, the machinist. Yeah, that's a good one. There you go. Uh, All right, opposite. Yeah, so yeah, no, Paul Bettany. I, I, I don't. I wasn't too big a fan of him. And, uh, if anything, probably just I can't. I can't really say. I don't. I don't. I know, I'm not. Yeah, it's tough, right? It's hard. I if know. anything, if there's a beautiful mind, and because I did a Fuck, pretty good job. I forgot job about in there. that. That's a good one. Yeah. And uh, um, a Christian Bale would guy. probably be uh, um, man, what uh, the prestige? Prestige is good. Either that or out of the furnace. It's really hard to. It just I don't know. There's so much he's done. It's just fucking great. It's just hard to contend with each other, yeah. and uh, uh, and then fucking Jake Gyllenhaal. I like. I love him in Zodiac. Oh, oh yeah, yeah. that's right. Yeah. Good. Oh man, good name. Yeah, drop. fucking Boy Scout. Man, that's a great fucking movie. That's a good movie. He's fucking Speaking so of, obsessed. It's great. And Paul Giamatti. No, 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 no. I was talking about uh, no, 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 uh, Giam- uh, Gyllenhaal. I get no, it. I said, and Paul and Giamatti. Paul and your movie. Like, what's your movie for Paul Giamatti? I thought I said that first. No. No, you uh, said Paul Bancourt. Uh, probably, you know, Paul. well, it'd be Barney's version. Oh. All right. <laughs> <laughs> I like that face. Right. man. He's just disappointed. Like, no, because he I just feel fucking force right now. That's why. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> I was talking about him. Fuck him. He's just disappointed at your so, answer. <laughs> well, no, I wasn't disappointed at his answer. Like he lost count because uh, I think he just lost track because somebody oh. being distracting. Um, What's this beer? Everybody but gonna finish this beer. <laughs> you brought those. They've been here for so long, oh, wow, and it was Raph's <laughs> job to drink those Daddy, PBRs. Please, I don't want it <laughs> and anymore. Now I gotta suck thy D. Thy D. In case anybody didn't know the reference to that, so yeah. earlier today, Raph posted a quote in our um, group chat. Yep, he was like, "If anybody gets this." I'll suck your dick right away. Within five seconds, I had the movie and the actors that quoted it. And he was like, I know, yes! right? You fucking. Oh, God damn it. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and the quote was, pop quiz, hot shot. 
<laughs> Speed, one of my favorite movies. Oh, yeah, that's a great movie. Yeah. With Let's Adam. go, fucking Schlep Rock. Where's that from? <laughs> <laughs> Where's that from? Let's just start uh, naming quotes and see if we can get them. Come uh, on. Let's go, Schlep Let's go. Rock. Let's go, Schlep Come on. Rock. Nobody, Let's go, Schlep Rock. I know Nobody this. knows all these obscure know Come on, that's quotes. the whole point. Oh, uh, uh Boiler Room. Yeah, I yes. said that. Yes. Oh. Let's go, Schlep Rock. Yes. It's fucking great. Speaking of what which, are you, last night's erection? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> what else has, has that guy done? Uh, oh. fucking... Vin Diesel? A no, lot. No, no. <laughs> ben Affleck? Oh, yeah, a lot. He plays in Boiler Room. He plays in Giovanni? Fucking... Oh, Paul Rabisi? Yeah, or Giovanni, Giovanni Rabisi? Rabisi. Yeah. <laughs> Giovanni Rabisi? <laughs> Giovanni? <laughs> Nicky oh, Cash? Yeah. Giovanni? <laughs> That's no, but what has he hasn't done I'm, shit? He hasn't been in a lot of stuff. What about yeah. Nicky Katz? <laughs> he's he's, he's on a show on Amazon Cats. Prime Fuck called him. Sneaky Pete. You know what I'm talking about, right? No. You know who Nicky Katz is? The guy that gives uh, Gio- uh, Giovanni uh, Ripsy shit for fu- uh, fucking his uh, ex girlfriend. Come on, any other quotes? Mm. Come on, come on. I got one. I got come one from on, actually on. from the same, the same movie. Uh, I'm not your girlfriend, Seth. <laughs> <laughs> Relationship? <laughs> what are we dating? Yeah. You're not your girlfriend, Seth. I mean, I might come every now and then and sneak in your house and blow you, but I'm not your girlfriend, Seth. I might come in here. I'm, I'm a goddamn come- father. <laughs> <laughs> you know, geez, Seth. You know, if my, if I was to tell my father to have a cup of coffee over my screw ups, he'd tell me that he would laugh about it. He'll be over and fuck me. Yeah. He'll be over and fuck me. Jesus, Seth. Get your shit together. Or I'm taking down a casino myself. I'm gonna fucking bring down the house. Remember? He's like, wait, 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 Seth. Wait, 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 hold on. He's like, at the end, he's like, room, you know, the, uh, he's like, you wait, 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 Seth. You, you, you took down a casino. He's like, yeah, I shut it down for you, Seth. Like, you, you just compromised my whole scam. He's like, I was gonna take that fucking place down personally or some shit. I picture him saying That's something like that. He was a fuck over his own. Daddy knock around, guys. Oh uh, yeah. Oh yeah, yeah knock around guys. Yeah, that, that was a good one. Yeah, hell yeah. Look, he's half a I moron that and that's the good half. <laughs> <laughs> I should have fucking known better. Yeah. Uh, yeah, Vin Diesel's in that movie too. He starts taking <laughs> all this shit. Yeah. 500, yeah. 500, 500, 500, the milkman gets paid. The fucking <laughs> 500 no what? 500 fights. That's how many fights I figured I'd have to be in to be considered a badass. Yeah. <laughs> build like leather Dude, skin. Seth yeah. Green. Like what the fuck is Seth Green doing? No. Yeah, I swear to Christ. Uh, he does his own shit. Like, well, he's still doing like robot acting, chicken. Yeah, voice and, yeah, acting and, yeah, and shit, like but still. like Yeah. Last time with Solomon. Uh, Can't hardly wait. He yeah. was in, uh, what was it called? <laughs> uh, that The movie about the startup of National Ampoon. <laughs> uh, he was in there? Oh. He was in there. That's a good movie, like uh, like a fragile, fear, uh, a fragile, and uh, no, fragile a futile, mind. no, a, a futile, futile, and uh, something gesture or some shit like yeah, that. Yeah, something a futile, will, will stupid Ford, gesture. Uh, will Will Forte and um, and, uh, uh, Arnett, whatever something Gleason. No, Will Arnett. Will it's Arnett, a good no. Yeah. It's it's a Netflix made it. It's based on the people that started. Uh, the National, uh, National Lampoon. Lampoon magazine. magazine. Oh, nice! It's great. Yeah, yeah, it's a good movie. It's a good fucking movie. They yeah. talk about uh, the first movie they did, which was Animal House, and the yeah. second movie, which is a uh, Caddyshack. Caddyshack, yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 They had people it's that too, played Harold Ramis and Bill Murray, and, and uh, oh, nice. And, and, yeah. and what's it called? Even what's uh, what's his name? Fucking, uh, 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 no respect. Uh, no, 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 uh, Ryan Ryan Daniels. Daniels. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. It's funny too because like uh, they in that in that movie. They talk about was like a uh, Caddyshack <laughs> was a disaster to make, <laughs> yeah. and they had no, uh, they didn't realize that at the time there was going to be a cult classic. Oh, no. They they were just doing blow and fucking <laughs> just just <laughs> fucking, yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah. Oh, fucking, up the, fucking up the oh yeah, uh, dude, the fucking movie. Bill Murray was like. They didn't even have lines for his character. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like he was. Just, they were just like fucking film it, whatever. Like, <laughs> yeah. They, they like it was such a disaster of a movie. Like to keep the plot line going in the movie, and then like they you you watch that movie, it's so funny. Yeah. Holy shit, it's so. What funny. movie we're talking about? Caddyshack. Caddyshack. Oh, Caddyshack. Okay, Caddyshack. I'm sorry. sorry. Yeah. Yeah. I thought you were still talking about your uh, the, the other movie you were mentioning. Yeah. How, the the founders of that show. Like, oh yeah, yeah. yeah, 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 yeah. Did somebody well, play Belushi? I, I yeah. think that I think yeah. that Caddyshack was a National Lampoon's movie, wasn't it? It was. Yeah, 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 yeah it was. It's yeah. just, uh, yeah, it like was, I said, it is. so the first one was the guys House. didn't know how good it was going to yeah, be. Yeah, and then they the vacation movie too. Vacation movie. Yeah, yeah. Actually, yeah, it's like that's right after what's it called? After Caddyshack. Yeah, I believe so. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. I wish they would make another vacation movie. Besides a stupid shit remake or reboot. But that's not Uptown National Lampoon, is it? All oh, oh, it's it's National Lampoon. Dick, I want Chevy Chase to come back, baby. Oh, yeah. Che- well, yeah. I want Ronnie Dangerfield. <laughs> <laughs> Caddy, 
Goddamn Caddyshack. So many good quotes. So many good quotes. What's the one? He's like, an ATM, a hundred dollars. A hundred dollars bill. The Vegas vacation comes out. Like, oh, they turn it right to the turnaround. Yes, fucking slow. Changing fifteen hundred. Oh, that movie is phenomenal. Oh yeah, national vacation or Vegas vacation? Vegas vacation. Both, but Vegas vacation is a little bit better. Vegas vacation. I think it's fucking hilarious. Papa Giorgio. Yeah, Nick, Mr. Papa Giorgio. Hey, Nick from Phoenix, Arizona. (laughs) (laughs) And he talks like that. No, not I necessarily. Put a, I put but, a dollar in a one a car. Put a dollar in a one a car. Oh, eat yeah. the yeah. Embry. Yeah, eat yeah, the yeah. 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 I love that ending. Yeah. Yeah. And they're all driving and they yeah. fucking cross lane. <laughs> well, you take this or one you and you take vacation, the other one. Man, where he's yeah. like, you know, uh, he, he he gets him the list of the uh, for Chevy Chase to buy his kids something. Like, you know what? Put, put something on the list for yourself. Get something real nice. <laughs> I haven't seen him forever. Oh, man. <laughs> Like, Shitter full. Yeah, <laughs> I, lo- I, lo- I love European vacation too, oh, man. I, I, I know love that. You know, that. You know she know died, that. right? The daughter. Yeah, I I listened Damn. to the commentary. Chevy really? Chase. She died. Like, she died not that long uh, after the movie. Yeah, early nineties. Wow, because she of had, breast cancer. But we, right? well, she had some some a lot of uh, uh, health issues. For she was young. Sad. Yeah. Sad. Really yeah. Bad. She had like a promising career too to be like an athlete or something, but. Her health issues just What was her name? Oh, I don't know. Shit. Uh, the European she vacation. Was funny, like, daughter. Audrey. <laughs> Audrey, yeah. yeah. That's a good <laughs> one, too, man. You're, they keep on going around and yeah, around. Big and around. Ben. <laughs> <laughs> going crazy. He's this losing it. There's Big Ben. All I, can, all I can think of is fucking Vegas vacation. He's like, oh, I love your wife. You want to make $14 the hard way? <laughs> Are you talking about the guy playing Sinatra? No, the, no. I'm talking about Rodney Dangerfield where he's talking oh. to Judge Smalls' character. And he's like, oh, hey, you're a lovely lady. You must have been something before electricity. From Vegas? What? No, Vegas from vac- Caddyshack. Oh, yeah. you said Vegas Vacation, though. Oh, my yeah, bad. Yeah. I've been drinking. Oh, 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 oh. i never seen Caddyshack, so. You've never seen Caddyshack? I've never seen it either. Holy no. shit, you've got to watch Caddyshack. That's our homework. That's our homework. I'll watch okay. it. Y'all have never Not seen Caddyshack? I've seen it now. I've seen it now. Oh, my God. Yeah, Rob is, is pissed. So Rob is pissed. Out of my house. <laughs> oh my god, that movie's so funny. If my I mean, dad heard you say that, <laughs> yeah. of your coworker, I can't help but think about fucking your coworker, but but most. <laughs> but the gift and receiving, you know, a gift, a uh, coworker giving a gift to another coworker, uh-huh. and then he just kind of just said, eh, and he's like, man, I give you that gift at the bottom of my heart. Oh man, <laughs> hey, what's it called? Um. Uh, yeah, you were there. You were there. What's it called? This was, uh, I was working with, uh, you, uh, Matias and, uh, Chris. I was working with y'all guys and it was like a Christmas exchange or yeah. something like that. Oh, man. And fucking, uh, Matias gives, uh, Chris a fucking, uh, a book right, about right. Gen- Genghis Kong, I think, or something Oh, like yeah, because, yeah, yeah. And then Chris just leaves the book, you know, at the, sh- uh, at the shop and fucking, <laughs> fucking Matias calls him up and says, hey, man. You left your book here, man. I give you that gift from the bottom of my heart. This <laughs> 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 picture is accent like, oh, I didn't know it was on a phone. And then Chris comes I just back pictured it. Back it. it up. Yeah. <laughs> I pictured this is in person, not over the phone. And like, Matias is standing up. I was like, hey, man, what'd you do with that book? Or, like, I just, you know, left it there. And he's like, what? <laughs> he's got his hand, one hand in his pocket. Like, man. I give you that gift from the bottom of my heart. Fucking doing his hand, <laughs> having his hand underneath his heart, like shaking like that. You know, uh, going back to <laughs> Ron- Ronnie Dangerfield, my, mm-hmm. my favorite movie from him would have to be uh, National Born Killers. That's for Raph. He was. Yeah. Oh yeah, he was. <laughs> yeah, right. yeah. Uh, it's not my favorite fill, movie, but uh, <laughs> filling up on what's her name. Uh, what, what's the chick's name? Uh, I forgot. Julia. The, uh, the girl from uh, Julia Roberts. I'll do that. No. I'll do that for you. Uh, you know, in a. Uh, from Dust of Dawn. From Dust of Dawn. <laughs> Wait, was Selma Hayek? <laughs> no, no uh, Julia uh, something. Uh, oh, Julia. the deaf girl. She's she's a de- no. She's a yeah. The deaf girl and um, not I am Sam, but the one with the <laughs> yeah. uh, Rubisi, uh, yeah. Giovanni Rubisi. Yeah, Rubisi, yeah, Natural yeah. Born Killers, <laughs> no, Natural Born Killers. Yeah, she was on there. <laughs> Julia, uh, Julia, Julia, oh, yeah. Julia, Julia. Oh, yeah. oh, oh Julia. are you talking about? Are you talking about it's it's retard night on TNT? Yeah. <laughs> It's funny, remember years ago, it's like on Saturday, and it's like, like tonight, set on 7 o'clock on TNT. Something uh, Lewis. Something Juliet Lewis. Lewis. Yeah, what's that, Lewis, yeah. that? That movie that Juliet, uh, Juliet Lewis and, 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 uh, uh, and Giovanni and Giovanni's Risley. in, whatever it's called, and you know, they're, they're the retarded. Starbucks they're mainly challenged or whatever. And then, followed by, I am Sam. And it's like, what is this like? I just pictured it was like, it's retard night on TNT. <laughs> <laughs> it's like, first up at seven. <laughs> no, no, this, no. followed by, I am Sam. Juliette Lewis, she was in, remember, she was in old school. 
at the beginning. Yeah, yeah, I'm here for the gangbang. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> uh, I'm here for the gangbang. <laughs> she was in the uh, um, what's he in Gilbert Grape, right? No. Gilbert? Yeah, what's he in Gilbert Grape? I don't think she I was. Never, I no, movie. I think she was uh, she, trying to get with she? Johnny Depp. Oh, okay. I think. Okay. She really? I haven't seen that movie in a long time. I don't know, time. man. She would have been really young in that movie. Or maybe, maybe trying to get with Leonardo. No, not Leonardo DiCaprio. Follow <laughs> 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 by <laughs> Return night on TNT. <laughs> we're talking about what's eating Gilbert Grape. Uh, no, 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 the other one. I know, no, no, no. We're, I we're talking. Oh, no, I know, she I get what you're saying. saying. But we're following oh, it. We're following okay. up with that. The, 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 was there a remake of that one yeah. movie? Something about uh, something Forrest Gump could be on edition too. Uh, what was that one movie? <laughs> the, the marathon. The Matt Dillon. Matt Dillon uh, and, and something about Mary. I love those retards. Yeah. <laughs> I love those retards. Isn't that a little politically big, incorrect? Like, yeah, you know, <laughs> keep them, you know, but I'll nobody's like, going to tell changes. me who I can and can't work with. <laughs> oh, okay, yeah. Fucking, the, so I got this big mongolite looking looking fucker. <laughs> hey, in a cage. <laughs> they keep, no, no, keep no, they in a cage? That's bullshit. No. No, well, that's what I said. <laughs> <laughs> we got, well, Mongo, we got him on this <laughs> on this line. <laughs> he can run back and forth. <laughs> Fucked up, man. That's awesome. <laughs> oh man, comedy man. <laughs> okay, uh, that's, right. that's San Matt Francisco Dillon for you, man. Dillon, oh yeah, fucking I San thought Francisco. that was. I thought Rice-A-Roni was the San Francisco treat. <laughs> well, they're expanding. <laughs> they're expanding, yeah. Florida, yeah. Oh, that's fucking crazy. Fucking great. Uh, she packed down a couple. Of, no way. He's like called her a whale a or bro, yeah. what was Well, he saying? goes back and he's like, I think I really want to. Wait, you mean roller pig? Yeah, that's <laughs> fucked up, man. He's just—it's funny. Like every time he thinks that, five like, different guys, five kids, three different yeah. guys, no rock. Yeah. No rock. <laughs> every time he thinks like he's like okay, he's gonna go away after this statement. Like he just keeps making it fucking worse to convince him not to go down and check yeah. her out. It's so fucking funny. Oh, uh, she was a natural uh, born killers. Yeah, she who? was. Oh, Julia Lewis? Or, I mean, yeah. she was in what, What's Hitting what, Gilbert, Gilbert Grape. Grape. Yeah. Gilbert? Oh, she was? Gilbert, Gilbert yeah. Grape. Yeah. Oh, okay. I think she worked at the grocery store. Here's your chime. And Johnny Depp was going to get all, <laughs> all the time groceries for Big Mama or whatever her name was. Mama. What was that? Uh, <laughs> shit. Uh, Blue Man? No. Rumpus Room. Blue Man. No. Rumpus Room. Blue Man. Gilbert. Man, um, this this chick grabbed Julia Robert. Uh, no, what was it Lewis? Julia, Julia Lewis. Lewis and Juliet. Uh, Juliet. Uh, Julia Ru- Lewis and uh, Robert De Niro. Cape Fear. Cape Fear. That's right. The remake. Oh, yes. yeah, she was counselor. in Cape Fear. Also. Yeah. Fucking yeah. mommy's own. Hey, so hey. I looked it up. By the way, my I looked. Pussy Richard. <laughs> wow. <laughs> um, I looked it up so that the the chick that died from National Lampoon's European Vacation. Yes. Yes. So she had a stroke, a paralytic stroke, and died like ten days later. Wow! She was thirty-two. 32. Wow! <laughs> Way to bring down the show. Yeah. What? <laughs> you guys are fucking stupid. You guys are fucking stupid. No, 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 no. no, no, no. <laughs> Harmonizing. Understands this reference. Man, shut up. That's why we're introducing it. Yeah. How do you think people understand references to begin with? Or how do you think people they understand watch anything fucking, to begin with? They watch the movie. How do you think people times? begin to understand anything to begin with? It's it, it's introduced. Eventually, so, people catch on. So today, and that's it. today is Friday the Thirteenth. Fuck that day. Fuck that number. Fuck you. <laughs> <laughs> So, um, so I, I would just like to go on record that I suggested <laughs> that we talk about where Friday the 13th started from and, like, why it, it's a superstitious That's number. That's bullshit. You're bullshit. You fucking You fucking should. go fuck yourself. No, you no, don't even need no, to no, talk no, no, about no, no, this. Fuck that. No, that's why, you know, I'm saying it's bullshit. Knights <laughs> Templar, da 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 blah, blah, blah. blah no, I don't number. know. That's why I wanted I to talk know. about it. There you go. I gave you the Reader's Digest in your words. <laughs> oh, you just, all you said was like six Knights words. Knights Templar, 13th, they, they, they die, the die, trials, Go fuck yourself with the Knights Templar. You know what? That's what that is. That's what it's about. It's, it dates back all the way to the fucking Knights Templar. Ooh. And it's an unlucky day on the 13th on a Friday. And two people died this, or some bullshit. This would have been an this, interesting topic of conversation. Not really. It's not that. Put this uh, six-pack plastic <laughs> ring in his bed. Maybe he'll so, just get his mouth trapped in it. Therefore, they have <laughs> buildings that are like the 13th floor doesn't exist. Oh, I heard about that. Yes. John Mayer's track on, on, on what's it called? 
on the 13th track is just a second and goes over. You know what I'm talking about? It goes into St. Patrick's Day. Mm-hmm. It's a Room for Squares album. Oh, that's right, yeah. On the 13th track, track, it's just one second, and it skips It skips over 13 and goes back to, you know, goes oh, into so 14. Wow. Did you know that, though? No, I didn't know that. I yeah. didn't know really yeah. course. What'd you say? What'd you Nothing. call me? I didn't want to talk about the history of 13. I wanted to talk about the history of right. Friday the 13th. Yeah, I just told you. Yeah. You told us like Jason some Voorhees. random bullshit. That's not random bullshit. That's what it's that random is. Bullshit. That's what the um, you're, you're talking about. Why is it unso- unlucky? What's the deal with Friday the Thirteenth? I just told yeah, you. Yeah, tell them what, we're just going for some Jason takes on Manhattan. Yeah, there we go. <laughs> That's, That's right, Jason. <laughs> Jason goes to Manhattan. Get oh, it right. right. Yeah. <laughs> He's on vacation. <laughs> Jason fucks Manhattan. No. There we go. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, like Debbie does Dallas. <laughs> there you go. Jason fuck Manhattan. Oh god! So yeah, I fast forward. It's bullshit. We're, we're, you know, it's it. Uh, that's fine. I got a Wikipedia. <sighs> this shit myself later. That's fine. Yeah. <laughs> Entertain yourself. You got to do. Something. I was curious though. Thanks. Paul. I was too. You know what? We could okay. have had a decent All discussion right. well, about. That. No, go ahead. No, no, no. Go fuck I'm yourself. I'm not stopping you. <laughs> nice Templar. That sounds like go it, for it. My up. guess. That my guess up. is you're saying Knights Templar that goes that goes into having to do with. Uh, uh, the the conspiracy to cover up whatever with 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 Christ and it has something to do I'm guessing with the 13 people present at the Last Supper. I, I don't know anything about that. And there being 13 people there and it being unlucky. No, I don't think so they that. say. Okay. Uh, yeah, <laughs> no, I don't know. I, 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 I'm, you know, I, I, I'm I, just throwing I, I, curveballs here. Twelve apostles Jason. plus Jesus. That's 13. I go under ladders all the time. My life is beautiful. <laughs> What does that have to do with Friday? It could have been better, probably. Because the numbers, it's unlucky, right? Mm -hmm. That's what it's associated with. (laughs) 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 Uh, uh. (laughs) You're fucking, now now somebody's about to be unlucky. (laughs) Now now we're going to prove this works. What what works? The the unluckiness of the fucking day. <laughs> so oh, what is, what, okay, so, so you walk under the ladders, it's unlucky. You break a mirror, it's unlucky. What else? <laughs> if you fuck a mirror, black you get cats. Luck. Black cats. <laughs> if you fuck a Air, mirror, stop. I feel like you're that's you were unlucky on, before you decided yeah. to do that. Okay. You got your, you're you're definitely going to be unlucky yeah. afterwards. I agree. Yeah. But what I, else is there? But you're what assuming, if you punch you're a assuming, leprechaun, you're assuming the mirror is in pieces. I'm talking about his whole baby. If you can find the leprechaun, <laughs> <are> you gonna... <laughs> you're just mashing it, baby. <laughs> 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 so you know our mindsets are obviously different. So, All right. Yeah. What else is unlucky? Um, raps being here. That's hair. definitely. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Yeah, and uh, uh, this and that. Can't and, think uh, of another um, unlucky people that believe that shit is thing. fucking stupid. So uh, <laughs> Jeez, just, no, that's, that's fucked up. What? 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 What's Opals, fucked up? They believe in, I don't know what Opal aliens. is, but supposedly uh, Opals hey, maybe are the unlucky. People, maybe, the, maybe the people that believe in Friday the Thirteenth and you say that they're stupid think that we're stupid for believing in aliens. Yeah, I yeah. never said I believed in aliens. No, you know, uh, Mister Rogers oh. had a puppet <laughs> named Friday the Thirteenth. I think. He oh, did? Really? I think, I think, you can fact check me. I, I think. think you're making shit up. No, no, Friday the 13th. That's cool. Yeah. I believe you now. King Friday the 13th. That's what it was. Yeah. King Friday the 13th. Yeah, that, that was Mr. Rogers' puppet. Oh, yeah? <sighs> yeah. He Good was one him. of the, the kings. That was know. the king in the in the land of make-believe. When the oh, the train? Yeah. King yeah. Friday the 13th. Ding, ding. You know, that's ding, the ding. King, king Friday. Friday, yeah. yeah I yeah. recognize king the dings now. You got the tone right. That is, you are correct. Thank you, sir. Friday the 13th. That's nothing to be proud of, but all right. Hit him. You're nothing to be proud of. Yeah, so, I'm fine. Uh, I'm fine. I'm gonna fuck can you me. force? I'm going to pop your mouth later. I don't know if that will wrap us up, <laughs> but I do definitely do want to touch on if we have guests lined up for the the Dallas versus Houston. I think that we've got the lineup pretty much solidified. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Uh, we we're, we're still working Just on a secure venue. Secure a venue, yeah. Uh, once we secure up. a venue, we're gonna get this thing fucking set up and yeah. no first date dinner, straight to banging. Straight to banging. <laughs> uh, graphics out there for you. Uh, I think that we've decided that uh, instead of doing a Houston versus Dallas, who knows more about their city? I don't think that really proves anything. So we're gonna do a Houston versus Dallas. Which people that are fans of each city know more about the great state of Texas? There you go. That's and fair. I think that, uh, you know, we'll do some Texas uh, history and some Texas trivia, uh, music, pop culture, uh, beer. Uh, Where's Matthew McConaughey from? <sighs> he's from, I think he's from Houston, but lives in Austin. No. I think he's from I don't Austin, know. no? He's, he's from, from uh, Beaumont. 
No, he's from uh, okay, what's it called? Which is Houston? Orle way. I want to say Uvalde. Orle. You're making shit up. Yeah. I want to say he's from Uvalde. He's from I'm a gonna small, fact check. a small what's it called? A I'm small Texas check. town. Uvalde is not a small Texas town. Technically, it is. That's your opinion, man. <laughs> hey, Jacob, since That's close- just like your opinion, man. <laughs> Talk on Rob's beard for good luck for me, will you? Talk talk on his beard. No, gonna, talk. I want to sleep on his beard. Oh, uh, yeah, well, that's cool. You know, no, you, you can't do that. do that. Why not? Because I don't want you to. Well, well, that doesn't stop somebody from. Wow. Doing it. Yeah, you got it fucking right. He, yeah, he did. God damn you, yeah, man! <laughs> I know my shit. He was born. He was born in Uvalde. In Uvalde, Texas. Yeah. Okay, so what school did Ryan Davidson go to? Back, uh, oh, who, 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 podcast. Yeah, Rap, Mr. Know It All here. Who the fuck is Ryan Davidson? Uh, oh, I'm fucking with you. Wow. I'm fucking Ryan's with you. Gonna, Ryan, Ryan, if Ryan's you're gonna listening to this, he's gonna hit Segura through the wall. If, 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 <laughs> that's it, bitch. I'm fucking with you, Ryan. Ryan, Ryan, if, you're listen, Ryan, if, you're if you're listening, listening to this right now, I know I you won't be able to do your signature move on him, but you can definitely stone cold stunner him. I will fucking with you, Ryan. I'll run. I'll run screen. We'll support you on that. Yeah, totally. Uh, oh, no, no. Do some move on DDTs. What's up? He didn't answer the question. Where's uh, Ryan from? Yeah, where's no, from? no, no. What, what school did school? he go to? No, what college did he go to? College? No, no, no. You said high school. I didn't say high school. Okay, I just said school. What school. School. College. Shit. No, nah, I'm stumped on that one. Yeah. You said Waco, right? West Texas A&M. West Texas A&M. Where's that at? Well, that's over there. I think. Um, I think close to El Paso, maybe. Really? Oh damn! I'm pretty sure it's in West know. Texas. Yeah. No, I don't, I don't. I don't know where it's at. Very nice. I could be wrong. But um, I think that'll, I think that'll uh, wrap us up. Do it up, do it up here. Um, <laughs> oh, about goddamn time. I know, I know. <sighs> All right, for a Friday the Thirteenth episode, ladies yeah. and gentlemen, thank you for joining us. We are gentlemen, no class. Very I am much. Rob. Yes, I am Jake. We Using uh, Paul's catchphrase, "Ta ta, fuck you." <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'm rough, thing, but it's cool. I'll let I'm rough. Let it slide, and. I'm d- delightful, Paul, I guess, yeah. <laughs> Fucking Paul. <laughs> Fucking loser. <laughs> been, There's nothing delightful <laughs> about you. Fucking. <laughs> 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 and we're gentlemen, no class. Rape you. Have a good night. <laughs> Jesus.